Sorcerer, pick up Erta at the start author. Big Knife, Synopsis, Reborn in Fairy Tale World, occasionally pick up Erta who just escaped from the Tower of Paradise, and turn on the system. Join the Fairy Tale Guild with Erta. There are also many extraordinary abilities obtained through the system. Navy Six Style, Three Color Domineering, Rubber Fruit, Burning Fruit, Shaking Fruit and so on. Until this day. Dieta showed unprecedented power in the face of the Black Dragon at Kalonoya and Jeff! Exclamation mark. Chapter 1, Picked up a little cutie, for collection, for flowers, by the coast. A transparent fishing line was hung on the bamboo fishing rod, and the red worm was pierced by the hook and could only keep squirming and trying to break free. On the shore, a black-haired boy of about twelve years old sat cross-legged like an old monk, holding the bamboo fishing rod in both hands. His eyes were dull, and he mechanically threw the rod into the sea to try to fish. If you don't catch any fish today, you won't be able to eat, Dieter murmured. It has been twelve years since he was reborn in the fairy world. He knows that this world is different, and he also tried to learn magic. But that magic is not something he can learn in a short time. Today, he also relies on the meager assets left by his deceased parents to make a living. Because he is too young, many shops will not hire ordinary twelve-year-old children, so they can only rely on fishing on the coast to sell for money. System, Dieter thought silently, and a line of words appeared in his mind. Remaining until the system is turned on. 707 and 7 seconds seconds. Good. Dieter also has a system as a traverser, but his system has not been turned on for the time being, and it still takes 7 hours so far. It seemed like a long time, but Dieter was not in a hurry. He has been waiting for 12 years, and it's not too short of a while. Even if he really got some magical system, he couldn't make him eat dinner at night, and the top priority was to continue fishing. Fishing is an enjoyable hobby. Dieter, who was fishing, only felt that time passed so quickly. Whoa whoa. Seeing that the sky was about to darken, the sea surface splashed with waves. Dieter looked up and found a small boat not far away, and a small figure on the boat vigorously moved the oars towards this direction. Who's bothering me fishing? Dieter muttered. When the boat came on board like this, he didn't even think about fishing, so he sighed and took back his fishing rod to go to the neighbor's house to eat and drink. Boom. Just as he packed up his fishing rod and turned around, he heard the sound of something falling behind him. Dieter turned around again only to find that the figure on the boat had slumped weakly on the edge of the boat, apparently in a coma. As a result, the boat is not balanced enough, and if left unchecked, it may soon fall into the deep sea and sink to the bottom of the sea. It's unfortunate that this happened to me, Dieter complained. Sweeping around found no one nearby. I had to put the fishing rod aside and take off my overly heavy clothes and dived into the water to swim towards the boat. After a while, Dieter dragged the boat to the shore, looking at the armor on the girl on the boat. He also admitted that he was unlucky to carry her grabbed a few bags in the boat and walked towards the house. Dieter couldn't do it without dying. Although this world is very dangerous and there are supernatural beings such as mages, he still can't sit back and watch a little girl fall into the sea and drown. When he got home, Dieter threw the girl on a bed and brushed her hair only to find that the girl had an eye patch on her right eye. Appears to be blind in one eye. Bayxia has such a beautiful face, but why do I feel a little familiar? Dieter took a serious look. The long red hair looked good. The small arms and calves are also very healthy and the one eye that is not considered to be blind is considered a cute little one. That's what Dieter thinks he's seen before. Aren't you tired of wearing armor? Dieter said, reached out to take off her armor, and wiped her face with a damp towel. After finishing, I used the ingredients in the little girl's package to cook. After finishing everything quickly, she bent her knees and leaned against the edge of the bed to take care of the little girl. Boom. PFFT. In a daze, Dieter's body hurt and he fell to the ground. Ouch! Dieter exclaimed in pain. After opening her eyes, she found that the comatose little girl was staring at herself with a kitchen knife in her hand at the moment. Who are you? The little girl asked. The kitchen knife in his hand was stretched under Dieter's neck, and his voice was very cold, as if he would slit his throat with a slight movement. My name is Dieter, what are you doing so nervous, you little girl, you must know that I am your savior. If I hadn't seen you comatose on the boat, I wouldn't care about you. What's your name? Dieter shrank his neck and said. The little girl frowned and swept across the small house and the fragrant food on the table. The alertness in the voice dropped a little. My name is Urza Scarlet. Um? Dieter froze for a moment. She stared at the little girl in front of her with wide eyes. With a eye patch, long red hair, and the armor he wore before he started, he suddenly remembered why he felt familiar. What's your look? Urza glared at him. The kitchen knife in his hand was even more tightly clenched by three points, and there was a faint feeling of wanting to do it. Ah. Just a little surprised, but the name sounds nice, Dieter said hurriedly. So small Urza, does that mean she hasn't joined the fairy tale guild yet? Thank you. Urza thanked. Perhaps realizing that Dieter was not threatening his power, he retracted the kitchen knife and walked to the dining table to look at the food in front of him. You brought this food here. I've already eaten it. You're starving too. Eat it now, Dieter said. He got up from the ground and sat on the edge of the bed, watching her quietly. Chapter 2, 
Reward the Navy sixth form, exclamation mark for flowers, for collection, er, uh, uh, however, didn't eat the first time, and his eyes went back and forth between dieter and the food on the table, think for a moment and say, you eat first, dieter scratched his head, pretty vigilant, go over and sit down and start eating the food on the table one by one, Erza watched silently, seeing that dieter didn't feel any discomfort after a long time, and only moved his chopsticks after making sure that he was not poisoned. Ding, system starts, ding, the first sign in reward 6 skill points. At this moment, the countdown time in the brain was reset to zero and replaced with new words. It didn't take long for the word to appear and disappear again. Instead, it is an upside down tree diagram, with a thick trunk at the top and a few branches extending down. The lowest branch has 6 branches. There are 6 skill bars at the end of the fork, which are temporarily greyed out. Why don't you keep eating? Seeing that Data didn't move his chopsticks, Erzo immediately asked alertly, as if he was afraid that the poison in the food might have a certain fermentation time. Ah uh, dot 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 you can eat it with confidence. I have no grudge against you, so I won't poison you. Dieter was speechless after putting down his chopsticks. He walked back to the bed, sat down, closed his eyes, and carefully studied the tree diagram in his mind. Erza didn't bother after thinking for a few seconds. Bed. Dieter was so absorbed in his mind that the tree diagram looked odd looking upside down. Fortunately, he was quickly attracted by the six skill bars at the end. Try to touch. Do you want to add some points? Just when I came into contact with that skill bar, new words appeared in my mind. Add a bit. Is it necessary to use the six skill points when the system was first started? Dieter decided to give it a try, using his mind to choose to add points. With the addition of points, the added skill bar is no longer grey and has been lit up. Dieter went to check immediately, the words reappearing in his mind. Iron block, one of the six naval styles, it can harden the body to withstand strength after use and cannot move during the use of the skill. What? Exclamation mark. Iron nuggets? Dieter couldn't help breathing quickly. He didn't expect to light up the skills in the world of pirates, and it was the Navy's sixth form that only the Navy can learn. You must know that the Navy's sixth form is also quite strong. Iron block, paper painting, gang foot, moon step, finger gun and shave. This is the six naval styles. If it can be used flexibly, it can barely make Dieter have the power to protect himself. Put your eyes on the skill bar again. Since this is the iron block that is lit up, then the rest must be other skills in the sixth form of the navy. Light up, light up, light up. Without a word, Dieter lights up all the navy six. After all the lights are lit, the six skills extend out a line and converge together. At the intersection of the line, a grey treasure box appeared. I tried to get in touch, but unfortunately I couldn't open the treasure chest and I didn't know what it was. Dieter took his mind back regretfully. Open your eyes and clench your fists to feel the constant power of this body. The six naval styles are also instantly integrated, and skills can be released at will. Is that power? Dieter murmured. The tense mood of twelve years has also been relaxed at this moment, and the unprecedented sense of security has also wrapped him, and his mood has relaxed a lot. I used to worry that I would be accidentally killed by a mage. Now you can rest assured that even if you can't beat the magician, you still have enough self-protection power. Knock knock knock. Suddenly, someone knocked on the door outside the small room. Both Dieter and Erza were immediately alert. It shouldn't be dangerous. Maybe it's a neighbor, Dieter said comfortingly. He walked to the front door and turned his head to look at Erza, who had been refreshed with a kitchen knife in his hand and nodded lightly. It seems that if there is danger, it will start, Creek Tilda. There was a screeching sound as the old door opened. After opening the door, there was no danger. Instead, there was a short old man standing outside with a kind smile. Yo how are you two little friends? The old man greeted. Dieter was also stunned when he saw the old man. Standing at the door was Makarov, the current president of the Fairy Tale Guild. It is also in existence rated as a holy ten by the Magic Council. Why did he come here? Hello, is there something wrong? Dieter asked without leaving a trace. Urs relaxed when he saw that it was an old man, and wondered who he was. Makarov walked in with a smile. His eyes swept across the small house and finally stopped at the dining table and lost his mind. The quick glance at Dieter was also quite friendly. I'm Makarov, the president of the Fairy Tale Guild. Makarov introduced, and continued with kind eyes, Dieter, I've heard of you. The neighbors in the neighborhood say you are a good boy who respects the elderly and loves the young. So, Makarov bonded, looked at Herza and Dieter with a smile and continued, want to join Fairy Tale? There is everything you want. Fairy Tale! Exclamation mark. Erza stared in disbelief, looking at the little Makarov in front of me. I think of the old man who helped me in those dark years. Chapter 3, Showdown with Makarov, for flowers, for collection. Taking a deep breath, his voice trembled, can I, can, join? Makarov nodded without thinking after hearing Urza's words, of course, fairy tale still welcomes you. Urza nodded, there is a joy in my heart that cannot be concealed. After all, she is only an eleven year old girl, and it is impossible to keep her face expressionless and not reveal any emotions. Dieter was silent. Fairy tale, I never thought you would come over and invite yourself. 
Dieter said sincerely. This guild is very strong. But what still surprised Dieter was that Makarov, the guild leader, would personally invite him to join the guild. Well, how should I say it? I just came here overheard from you. Fairy tale welcomes a good boy with a good heart. Will you come with me? Makarov said. He also just learned about Dieter's news not long ago. Hearing that he was a good boy with a good heart, he was very curious to investigate, and after knowing that his parents died early, he had the intention of accepting it. Even if he doesn't have any combat power. Without any related magic, Makarov will not regret making this decision even if he is an ordinary person all his life. I really like Dieter. Dieter, you should have nothing to worry about, why don't you come with me? Erza also persuaded. In a short time, she also learned that Dieter was kind. Plus Dieter looked pretty good, so he took the initiative to invite. After all, this is the boy who could save himself from the sea. The grace of saving life although she didn't say it. But I am still very grateful from the bottom of my heart. If I can be in a guild, I can repay my kindness in the future. Yes, but I want to try your strength. Dieter agreed after a little thought, but he wanted to try his hand at it before joining. Um, this time Makarov and Urza were surprised. You should be just an ordinary person, Makarov said. He didn't understand why the kid Dieter wanted to challenge him beyond his capacity. How could an ordinary person be the opponent of a magician? Also Urza was curious. Dieter seemed to be about the same age as her. Plus she was the age of a long body, how could she have beaten the president of a guild? It didn't take a second to know that Data was going to lose badly. But it doesn't matter, you can learn from me if you want. Let's try it outside. When Makarov was right, Data was going to find a plausible excuse to agree, and he simply agreed to his challenge without thinking too much about it. In my heart, I was also thinking that it would be a good to play casually with the physique of an adult for a while. That's good. Dieter nodded. The three walked towards the outside and came to the coast. There are few people on this street and there will be no accidental injuries. Little devil, I'll let you do three moves. How about standing still and letting you play whatever you want? Makarov said confidently. Dieter didn't refuse to agree directly. After a few meters away from Makarov, he was ready. Although Ayers knew that Dieter would lose, he still kept a safe distance, waiting for the end of the battle without thinking. In her opinion, this battle should be over in a few seconds, after all, an ordinary person can't be an adult opponent no matter what, especially since the other party is a magician, it is definitely not something that a teenage child can impress, both parties are ready, the breeze blew the clothes of the two of them, and there was an atmosphere of a life and death battle, shave, moved, Dieter didn't wait for any pre-battle shouts to get moving, one move, the shaved in the sixth form of the navy immediately disappeared in front of him stirring up a circle of dust. So fast, both Makarov and Urza exclaimed in their hearts. The eyes were wide, neither Makarov nor Urza took Dieter in their eyes. In their eyes, Dieter, who was an ordinary person, could not be an opponent at all. Result, no one expected Dieter to disappear from where he was standing in an instant as the battle started. This sudden change shocked both of them. Boom. The next second Dieter appeared in front of Makarov. A fist mixed with strong wind hit Makarov in the stomach. Nausea. Makarov suddenly felt that his stomach was hit, and a feeling of nausea hit. Subconsciously want to use magic to counterattack, but he soon realized that he was only fighting against a 12-year-old boy. How can it be? This is the only thought in Makarov's mind. 12-year-old boy. How could his speed become so fast? He disappeared in place in an instant, and when he reappeared, he was already in front of him. Indeed, Makarov admitted that he was careless. But even so, he is also the president of the guild, and his strength and physique must not be underestimated. Now I was almost beaten up by a 12-year-old boy. This huge gap made him feel a little uncomfortable, and he regretted saying that he had to make three moves. Even if it is this kind of strength, it will inevitably be a little uncomfortable. But since the words were spoken, naturally they could not be taken back casually. I just hope that the punch just now was the full strength of this kid. And Urza next to him saw it all. Impressive. Chapter 4, The Power of the Sixth Navy. Ask for flowers ask for a reward. Urza had always thought Dieter was a normal person, but his perception of him also changed. Dieter is so powerful. The ability that suddenly disappeared and then suddenly appeared just now made her unable to find the trajectory of her movement at all. She didn't even dare to say she could do it. Really great. Urza continued to watch with light in his eyes. Shave. Use the ability again to leave. Dieter returned to his standing position, looking at Makarov in front of him. He also had a certain understanding of his own strength. At the same time, the warm-up is over and ready to come true. Father, I'm serious. If you can't stand it, you better leave now, or you might get hurt if you're unprepared, Dieter said. Is Makarov strong? Of course, it was outrageously strong. The punch he had just done was almost his full strength, but Makarov was unscathed, so his face was a little ugly. Even Dieter felt some pain in his fist. That punch was as painful as hitting a steel plate. But fortunately he had a high degree of tolerance. Okay kid. Makarov didn't care. There was a bit of bitterness in my heart. The punch just now was still not punched seriously. If this is really serious and give yourself a few times, maybe it will really hurt. If you know that this kid has such strength, 
It is impossible to kill him and let you stand still. Now I have to pray in my heart a little lightly. Gang foot. Suddenly, Dieter kicked his legs, and two or three crescent-shaped energies were shot out, plowing the ground and cutting towards Makarov's body. F.C.K. Makarov cursed in his heart. This kid is really ruthless, and all this magic has been used. Immediately, his body flashed, and he raised his right hand and stretched out his index finger. A yellow light bloomed and collided with a crescent-shaped attack. Boom. Energy burst. The run-in with each other disappeared in front of eyes. However, shave. Dieter disappeared again and came to Makarov again. Without thinking, both hands stretched out their index fingers. Finger gun. Bubba Batilda. His hands turned into after images, and he stabbed Makarov's body up and down. Makarov's pupils were tightly locked and he clenched his teeth to resist the attacks. The pain all over the body also caused Makarov to lose his temper. Grab the gap and immediately clench your fists. I saw that the fist was immediately enlarged, turning into a fist the size of an iron cauldron and slamming into Dieter. Makarov didn't react until he punched a huge fist. He secretly thought that it was not good, and immediately took back a lot of power. Watching the fist is about to drown the body, Dieter spreads his legs and crosses his hands in front of him. Iron. In an instant, Dieter's body was stiff and iron was all over his body. Boom! Exclamation mark. The fist collided with Dieter's whole body, and there was a dull sound of steel colliding. Hula. At the same time, Dieter was also beaten back by a huge force, and his feet were pair marks. Click till. Dieter lifted the iron block and swung his arms a little surprised. As expected of Makarov who can serve as the Holy Ten, even the physical strength that he is constantly exerting is not something he can contend with now. A tingling, tingling in both arms. On the opposite side, Makarov's face was not very good. Looking down at his clothes, holes were also poked open. Although there were no wounds on his body, if he looked closely, he would find that the places where he was hit were already glowing red. Even a few places with weak defenses turned purple. Little devil. You really are not simple. It's only a matter of time before you work hard in the future to become an S-rank mage. Makarov sighed. Are all the little devils so strong these days? If he hadn't reacted in time, he might have really overturned today. It seems that I can't learn from this kid dieter in the future, otherwise I might suffer a big loss at some point. The old man is joking, I just want a place to live, and S-class mages don't demand anything. Dieter smiled. Ayaza next to him also walked in front of the two people with complicated eyes. Looking at Dieter with complicated eyes, you are amazing, much stronger than me. You are only 12 years old, but you are already so amazing. Ayaza is also observant, although this time the sparring failed to hurt the president, but it can be seen that he is not very happy as the president. In my heart, the impression of Dieter was suddenly much taller. Sure enough, strong people are more attractive. Even if you're only 12 years old and older than you, you should be called brother. Dieter jokingly laughed. Urza's ears turned red when he heard this, but he quickly backed off. But it was still captured by Dieter keenly. I was a little surprised, but Urza was really cute when she was a child. It's a fight, so let's go home. Makarov suggested. There was a hint of anticipation in both Dieter and Urza's eyes. Smiling nod. After I went back and simply packed my luggage, I followed Makarov's pace home. Dot. Chapter 5. Join the Fairy Tale Guild. Ask for a reward. Ask for flowers. Magnolia. Fairy Tale Guild. Welcome to Fairy Tale. This will be your home from now on. At the entrance of the guild, Makarov turned to look at the two people with his hands behind his back, and was very happy to warmly welcome them. Dieter looked up at the large building of Fairy Tale. As expected, both the architectural style and the street at the door made him feel familiar. This is Fairy Tale. Urza is also stroking the building in front of him. Let's go. Go in and see your friends. Makarov replied with a smile, reaching out and pushing open the door of the fairy tale guild. What caught my eye was. Slaps. Oh, ooh, come on, great punch him in the face. Ha ha ha, Wakaba, you're a real dish. You can't even beat a child, but if Grey beats you, you can only run away. Laugh at me. Grey quickly frees that Wakaba guy with ice magic and beat him. Inside the guild hall, with a cigarette in his mouth, a young man wearing a green coat is being chased and beaten by a naked ten year old child. Damn it, kid, don't think I dare not hit you. It's just that you don't want to bully you when you're young. Wakaba shouted aggrieved. Grey drooped his eyes, put his right fist on the palm of his left, and grinned and roared. If you dare to play me, prepare to die. You bastard can't play, I'm going to fight back. Come, the two are about to fight with magic. Makarov, who had just entered the hall, turned black, took a deep breath and roared. You idiots, don't use magic to fight in the guild. As he said that, Makarov's body instantly grew to the point where it reached the ceiling above his head. Silent. The entire guild fell silent in an instant. Everyone stopped and looked at the president who had grown bigger, Humphrey. Grace snorted coldly to withdraw the magic. Wakaba was also relieved. Hello. The president is back. Where did you go today? You are the two little guys behind the president and newcomer. The people in the guild greeted immediately. Seeing this, Makarov regained his enlarged body, nodding solemnly. Yes, Dieter and Urza are both newcomers, 
I hope you don't bully people casually. Makau and Wakaba sat together and looked at Dieter and Urza. The whisperers didn't know what to say. It's a little different than I imagined, Dieter muttered. He always thought that the source of Grey's fondness for fighting was because of Natsu, but he didn't expect Grey to fight with people often at this time. At the same time, his eyes swept across Kana, who was sitting beside him getting drunk. Grey stepped forward, looked at the two, and asked, Master, are they two family? No, Makruf replied. Dieter is twelve years old, and naturally taller than Grey. Looking at him condescendingly, what are you looking at? Drooping eyes, exhibitionist. You, Grey was angry. On the other hand, Dieter didn't take it seriously. Isn't the tradition of joining a guild just to show strength? There is only Grey in the entire guild. Who else can you fight if you don't fight him? In addition, Dieter really wanted to be the boss, and subduing Grey was pretty good, so he took the initiative to find fault. Damn it, I'm going to fight you, if it's a man fight me. Grey gritted his teeth. The people in the guild were a little excited when they heard this. Wakabu immediately shouted, is someone going to fight again? This time is the new one fighting with this kid Grey? Great. Let's start. Awesome. All the little guys who join the guild these days are so fond of fighting. Makau also said. Makruf didn't care much, because he knew that even in a fight, Grey was no match for Dieter. Indeed, Grey's ice magic is very powerful. But now Dieter's elusive ability, even he was amazed and it was impossible for him to lose. It just so happens that the guild also needs a big brother who plays an important role among children. Dieter is kind-hearted, helpful and has a role that fits the big brother. Be careful. Next to him, Urza swept across Grey with a blindfold, unexpectedly taking the initiative to care about Dieter. Hearing this also made Dieter feel a little strange. As far as he knew, Urza was withdrawn when she first joined the guild, and it was Grey and Natsu who slowly opened up to her withdrawn personality. It was actually related to him at this time? but still nodded in response, thank you. Putting his eyes on Grey, he grinned, it's okay to fight, but if you lose, you will call Big Brother, do you know? You bastard. Grey tickled his teeth with hatred, Dieter didn't give him a chance to refute, turned around and walked outside, waving at the same time, put on your clothes and come outside to discuss. Ah, Grey looked down and saw that he didn't have any clothes on. Immediately run away and get dressed. Wow the newcomer still has the courage to fight Grey. I don't know who is more powerful. I think it's Grey, that kid named Dieter looks weak. It's not certain. Everyone in the guild was discussing curiously. Analyze which of the two people is stronger, and make bets at the same time. Chapter 6, Navy 6 Forms, Paper Painting, Ask for Flowers, Ask for a Reward. On the road in front of a small river at the entrance of the guild, guild members and President Makarov, Drunk Kana, and Urza all walked out of the guild and quietly watched the upcoming match. Grey, don't be too embarrassed, boy, Wakaba shouted. Makau is holding a glass of wine next to Kana, who looked like a child and asked, Kana, who do you think has a better chance of winning? Hiccup Kana hiccup drunkenly, dangling her hand holding the glass to Dieter, he, hig, will win. How is that possible? Could it be that that kid has already learned magic? Macau couldn't believe it. Magic needs to be learned. When I was young, I didn't know anything, so how could I learn magic? Kana shook his head, it's not. He looks, handsome, in the field. Grey naturally heard the words of the guild members. Seeing that Kana was not optimistic about himself, he was also very depressed and retorted, Humphrey, he looks as big as me, how could he be my opponent, I have learned magic from Malu since I was a child, can we start? The opposite dieter stood silently and asked when Grey was still chatting, Grey hummed disdainfully, come on, I will definitely beat you, everyone watched, wanting to see who the strongest kid in the guild was, let's make gun, shave, Grey performs the ice shape magic action, the move was not finished, and dieter suddenly disappeared in front of him, what, how did that kid disappear suddenly? What was that thing just now? Macau was originally watching the play, but exclaimed in shock as soon as the duel started. He thought that he was still a bit strong, and he thought that a fight between two children would be boring. The result did not expect to disappear suddenly. At that speed, he couldn't even see his figure, and he couldn't even see how he disappeared in front of his eyes. Are children of this age so powerful? Also shocked was Macau's good brother. Wakaba's cigarette fell to the ground in shock. His little eyes were also opened in surprise at this time, and he swallowed and patted his good brother's shoulder. He asked inconceivably, I dot 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 did I have hallucinations? How could he be so powerful and disappear in an instant? Kana also stopped drinking. In her impression, the fight between two people is nothing more than a few tricks. But now it shocked her. The president, Makarov, had a faint sense of superiority, and he was very happy to see the members who were shocked and fell to the ground. There is a feeling that everyone is drunk and I am awake alone. As expected of Dieter, it really refreshed the three views of this group of people in the field. Also shocked was Grey who said in his heart that it was impossible. Before he could attack, he had already lost his target. Is this really the physique and strength that a twelve-year-old should have? You are too slow. Before Grey could react from his shock, he heard someone talking behind his back. The body immediately turned round, trying to counterattack. Peng. Unfortunately, 
His movements were still too slow in the end, and before his body could turn around, he felt a punch in the back. Body inertia was beaten out. He fell to the ground and slid abruptly for a few meters, and his little face was scratched into a layer of skin. It hurts. Gray immediately curled up on the ground, covered his face and rolled, screaming in pain. Too slow. Dieter retracted his fist with regret. Perhaps because of the difference between the world of pirates and the world of fairy tale, he could clearly feel that the Navy Sixth Form was much stronger than he imagined. Otherwise, he could not have caught Macruff by surprise if he was careless. It's as easy as an ant for ten-year-old Gray now. Damn it I won't admit defeat. Gray got up angrily. Get ready to attack again. Come on Gray, you are a senior who joined the guild first, don't let the newcomers look down on you. Ha ha ha, Gray kid, hurry up and admit defeat. This newcomer is much better than you. Awesome, the guild's newcomers are getting stronger and stronger. Come on, give him some color to see. Among the members of the guild, Gray was beaten with no power to fight back, and he had no intention of being distressed at all. He also kept urging Gray to make him use some force. Everyone laughed wildly. Let's make middle dot lances. Gray unleashed magic, shooting multiple ice spears from his hand, stabbing at all angles at a rapid rate. And Dieter grinned when he saw the ice spears. The body seemed to change in an instant and the body that was standing upright suddenly swayed. Paper painting. The body seemed to have no bones, like the seaweed swaying freely in the sea. It seems to be swaying back and forth, left and right, but it is often able to avoid the attack of the ice spear. What? Macau was really stunned, looking at Dieter who was shaking his body wantonly and asked in surprise, What is this? How can a person's body be in that shape? There are many crisscrossed bones in a human body, which support the human body. But at this moment Dieter was shaking like a string, as if there weren't any bones that could be soft to that extent. This is simply anti-human. Just kidding, President, is this kid really human? Wakaba was also stunned. That soft and boneless movement is not inconsistent. This unscientific. Chapter 7, To Bullying, Ask for Flowers, Ask for a Reward. Not to mention Wakaba and Macau, the current president, Makarov, was also about to drop his jaw. He'd had a conversation with Dieter. There are a lot of abilities that he has shown so far but he has never seen this body dance like a bonus body. Is it human? At this moment, Makarov couldn't help but have such absurd thoughts in his heart. But he quickly suppressed the doubts in his mind, and responded by pretending to understand, of course it is a human being. The President, do you know what's going on? Mukau asked a question. Makarov's expression was calm, but he was speechless in his heart. He knew what a shit. Magic is a very powerful thing. Any kind of magic is normal in this world. Maybe Dieter has some kind of special magic. But he couldn't say he didn't know. This is related to his identity and status as the president. He cleared his throat and said, it's magic. There are many magics in the world. At this moment, Dieter is using some kind of magic. Both Macau and Wakaba nodded. Although the president felt a little uncomfortable, he still obediently admitted this. Duel. Gray was also stunned, and those actions just now also subverted his three views. He thought that when his magic was released, Dieter would use the previous trick again and disappear in place, or come directly to the front to continue the attack. But he really didn't expect Dieter to swing like a seaweed in his ice spear. It was even possible to escape. What the hell are you? Gray was distressed. After thinking about it, the skills currently mastered seem to have no way to effectively prevent the situation just now. No matter what skills are released, they will be evaded. Hee <laughs> hee, that's all your moves are? Dieter laughed. After recovering, he charged directly in front of him intending to defeat Grey head-on to end the battle. Damn it! Grey was secretly angry, feeling underestimated. His eyes turned dark, and his eyes lit up immediately, and his hands once again performed the modeling magic move. Let's make middle dot floor. The cold ice-shaped magic is released. Grey immediately patted his hand on the ground, and saw that Grey's body was immediately covered with white frost, forming a smooth ground. Beautiful! Mukau exclaimed, with admiration in his eyes, using ice to create a smooth surface on the ground. It can make the opponent slip so that the new kid's previous moves can't be used. Dot. Not bad, Wakaba nodded with satisfaction. Gray, this kid, still has a strong sense of battle. After this trick is used, the newcomers can't fight in close quarters, and the battle situation is a lot fairer at once. Both brothers admire Gray's improvisation. This move may not be able to completely stop it, but it has been able to open up terrain that is beneficial to Gray. Even President Macruff was very satisfied when he saw this scene. Gray, this kid, is still very good and he made such a judgment based on the existing combat power. Already quite good. But there's no point in defeating Dieter. But unfortunately, Makarov knew that Dieter's abilities were far more than that, and the abilities called gang feet and pointing guns that he learned from are sufficient to deal with. In fact, this time, Grey has no hope of winning at all. Dieter didn't stop rushing forward. Even if the ice surface was under his feet, he had no intention of stopping at all. Continue to rush forward. The surrounding guild members and Grey were all staring at Dieter waiting for him to step on the ice and slip. However, Dieter jumped into the air the moment he stepped on the ice. Exposed in the air with nowhere to hide. Gray, now is the opportunity. 
He can't counterattack in the air, seize the opportunity. Wakab reminded immediately. Everyone else is waiting for Gray's offense and Dieter's downfall. And Gray knew to seize the opportunity. His hands were in motion again, ready to beat Dieter the moment he jumped onto the ice. Moonstep. Dieter landed face down. When he was about to step on the ice, a wave of air appeared under his feet, which immediately rebounded and jumped up again. Standing in the air, from time to time, air masses popped out from under his feet to keep him in the air. Everyone's smiles and expressions were frozen on their faces. It was unacceptable to watch this scene quietly, seeing that Grey was about to win, and the result. This dot 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 this is too cheating. Kana was in a mood. She and Grey were supposed to narrowly win. Result. This dieter actually flew straight up. Can fly. What kind of magic is this, and she wants to learn it even if it can fly? Exclamation mark. You dot 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 you are too much. Gray's posture also passively retracted, slumped on the ground and muttered speechlessly. The ability to fly, defend, and fast, all of which together don't give him any chance of winning. Every time he thought he was about to win, he hit rock bottom again. Moody. Don't take the burden directly. He he, you are very good, although you are a little short of me. Seeing Gray give up, Dieter slowly landed from the air and walked in front of him with a smile, reaching out and pulling him up. He took the initiative to hold his hand and introduced, My name is Dieter and I will be your elder brother in the future. You can ask me for help when you are in danger outside. Gray's gloomy introduction. My name is Gray Fullbuster. Please take care of me. The battle is over. Dieter wins with a psychic blow. The guild members all sighed and praised. It's amazing. I didn't expect that the children brought by the president are more powerful than the last. This little guy Dieter also looks like a good seedling. S rank mages may not need to question. The future is absolute. It's great. The Dieter kid is not weaker than us now. It seems that the guild will be the leader in the future. Admiration. This is true admiration. Whether it is Macau or Wakaba, they are all very happy at the moment. In their eyes, both Dieter and Grey are their younger brothers, and the stronger the younger brother is, the more face they have. And President Macruff is also very happy. Obviously, he is more satisfied with the strength shown by Dieter. Then welcome to Fairy Tale, Dieter and Urza. Macruff greeted him with a smile. Clap clap. The people around were applauding and cheering. Dot. Chapter 8, Natsu who joins the guild, asked for flowers, a reward, and an evaluation ticket. Sunny. The sea was splashed with ripples by the breeze. On the shore of the big sea at the entrance of the fairy tale guild, Dieter sat on the ground with a fishing rod and waited for the fish to take the bait. Mukau and Wakaba came from a distance with their baggage and greeted enthusiastically. Are you fishing again, Dieter? Yeah, you guys came back from the mission. Dieter turned his head to respond. Mukau laughed. Yes, we want to earn money to marry a wife. We can't compare with you. Ha 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 it's been a year since you joined the guild, don't you plan to do the quest? Wakaba also asked with a smile. Dieta laughed and didn't respond. Looking back at the float on the sea, it's been a year since I joined Fairy Tail, and Dieta has been very apologetic during this time. Every day is eating, fishing and sleeping. I am not interested in doing tasks at all, and rely on selling fish to support myself. Whether it was Erza or Grey and Kana who had already started to work, he was the only one who was still so idle. Dieta, after a long time. Urza's call came from the direction of the guild. After a while Urza came to him. Urza, you've grown a lot taller. It's been a year, I wonder how you're adapting? Dieter asked with a smile this time. The fastest integration in this year is Dieter, while Urza is not so cheerful. Nothing has changed except fishing with him from time to time, not so enthusiastic about Grey or Kana, and friends are a foreign word to her. Getting into fairy tale isn't a short-term goal either. It's okay, Urza replied with her head lowered. Dieter is also very helpless. He has never experienced Urza's despair and he has no right to let her out of that shadow. The only thing he can do is to chat with her more so that she will not be so withdrawn in the guild. Everyone is the same age and should get along well. By the way, the president asked me to come over and call you to show you your new partner, a young man with cherry-colored hair. Urza said hurriedly. Dieter hesitated a little after hearing Urza's description. He couldn't help but ask, what year is it now? Urza had doubts in his eyes, wondering why Dieter asked this, but he said, it's X-777. Year X-777. Dieter lost his mind. If I remember correctly Natsu should join the guild. According to Urza's description, the partner introduced by the president is likely to be the dragon slayer of fire. Okay, let's go back. Dieter agreed with a smile, put away the fishing rod from the shore, and walked towards the guild chatting and laughing with Urza. Come to the door soon. Ding. Sign into the fairy tale guild and reward six skill points. Suddenly, familiar fonts come to mind. Dieter couldn't help but stop, breathing heavily. The system appears again. The system that was activated after meeting Urza a year ago has since gone silent making Dieter think his system is dead, didn't expect this to happen again. For what reason? Could it be that Natsu can't do it? You must know that Natsu is the protagonist, so he was there to trigger the sign-in function of the system? It's quite right to think so. What's wrong with you? Urza asked suspiciously when Dieter stopped. Dieter quickly returned to his senses, smiled and shook his head. It's okay, 
just wondering if the newcomer is also a little monster. I don't know. Urza shook his head. The two continued to walk inside the guild and pushed the door in. Idiot, I said don't get so close to me. You exhibitionist, I don't want to sit with you. The president asked me to sit here. Fire spitting kid, I'll say it again. I'm not an exhibitionist. Slightly slightly drooping eyes. Are you fire breathing brat? I'm going to kill you. Dot. As soon as I entered the guild, I heard Grey and Natsu bickering. You and I will not deal with each other as soon as you meet. And you can't wait to destroy each other. Yo hello everyone. Dieta didn't care about the two more people. Raised his hand to greet the people in the guild. Everyone in the guild warmly welcomed Dieta. Dieta, take care of Grey and this guy named Natsu. They've been arguing as soon as they met. Wakaba complained. Macau also spoke. Without showing weakness? Yes. Aren't you the king of children in our guild? Urza, uh, Grey, and Kana can handle it. Hurry up and let them stop arguing. I'm going to be big. She who cares about him. Kana Tsundia retorted. Dieta smiled and stared at Natsu. The cherry colored hair and white scaly scarf and the warm tone of voice. Undoubtedly the same as in memory. Hey, you are the most powerful in the guild, right? At this time, Natsu left Grey's side and came to Dieta, looking up at him with his entire head above his head, with a strong suspicion in his eyes. He he. That's it. Dieta put his hand on Natsu's head and played with it. Natsu disliked it, and wrote down the gauntlet. Let's fight. If you lose, I will be the strongest in the future. Chapter 9. Competing with Natsu. For flowers. For evaluation tickets. For rewards. Ah. Dieta was stunned. Even the rest of the guild couldn't help being stunned. Even Grey was a little speechless. Ha ha ha. Did you hear that the new little guy is going to challenge Dieta? Laugh at me. Dieta doesn't fight very much in the guild, but he is quite strong. So this little guy wants to challenge himself beyond his ability. Are all the new little guys so brave these days? Dieta gave him a hand, and this little guy won't be a match. That's right. Come on Dieta, teach him a hard lesson, and let him know what a guild boss is. Dot. The ordinary members of the guild immediately burst into laughter. It's true that Dieta didn't do the quest, but this does not mean that his strength is weak. Even Dieta a year ago did not dare to say that he would definitely win. Not to mention that Dieta is definitely stronger now. Grey also shook his head, sarcastically. Hey, you don't have to be so direct even if you want to fight, it's better to go to Urza than to go to Dieta, he's very strong. Grey hadn't challenged since a year ago with Dieta, the reason was naturally because even now, he wasn't sure he could deal with Dieta's elusive moves. Kana, who was drinking over there, was also drinking heavily, and she was a little drunk and complained, you little brat, why bother to make fun of yourself? No one likes Natsu, it's not that I don't think he can't, but because Dieta's strength is simply beyond his peers, just fight Grey. Why don't you think about it and come to Dieta? Urza was also on Dieta's side at this time. After a year of getting along, she also regarded Dieta as her best friend. This will cause peers to humiliate themselves and fight back. Humphrey. Natsu raised his face, pinched his waist, and continued with a heroic and fearless role model. Don't you dare. If you don't dare, give up the position of your boss. Arrogant. Too arrogant. Dieta thought it was funny. But as the boss of the same age in the guild, it is natural to not admit it. Laughing. He turned and walked outside. Come on, let me see how powerful you are. Natsu followed with a majestic stride. Wow Dieta is going to shoot again after a year, so be sure to take a good look this time. I don't know if Dieta is better now than before. I'm really looking forward to it. Although I know this newcomer is definitely not an opponent, I still want to see it. Come on, Dieta, don't be knocked down by the newcomers. The members of the guild naturally fear that the world will not be in chaos. Hearing that Dieta was going to discuss with others again, he immediately swarmed over. It's still that way. Dieta took his place again. Standing in the air with Natsu, Dieta's thoughts were in his head. After getting the system to successfully light up the sixth form of the navy a year ago, although he practiced redoubled his efforts, but it didn't take long before I felt a bottleneck. I think the lack of skill points may be the skill points. Can you directly light up the treasure chest above the navy sixth style this time? It's still an upside down tree. The bottom six skill bars are still hanging with a navy six, and the line of the skill bar extended to a treasure chest above. Dieta tried to open it with skill points. The result is a line of words. The skill level of the sixth form of the navy is not up to the standard. After the words were displayed, Dieta was a little disappointed. In fact, he had an intuition when he went to light up the treasure chest icon. But it's a little sad to see the fact. Looking at the navy sixth form again, there is a number in the upper left corner of these skill bars. Iron block level 3, paper painting level 3, moon step level 3, finger gun level 3, post level 3, Shaving level 3. All 6 skills are level 3. Dieter thought for a moment and then added one more point to each. With the success of adding points, the 6 types of naval rank have reached rank 4. Dieter came to his senses. The skill proficiency of the 6 naval styles in the body poured into the body again. Physique, strength and speed are all improved. This improvement is huge. Now he is enough to deal with the 3 previous self. Damn it, I will definitely beat him. On the opposite side, Natsu refuted those people in the guild who were deliberately making fun of him. His small fists clenched as if he had made up his mind. 
Gray shook his head, feeling that Natsu was embarrassed. Why make fun of yourself? Even if Dieter hasn't shot for a year, it's not something you can deal with now. At the same time, President Makarov also huddled aside and watched silently. He is still very curious about Dieter's current strength. He wonders if he has regressed after not cultivating for a year. Be careful, he's playing with fire. Erta, uh, not far from Dieter, reminded him of Natsu's magical abilities. Okay, Dieter nodded, putting his eyes on Natsu again. He stretched his arms and hooked his fingers. Damn it, Natsu rushed in angrily, clenching his fists and punching Dieter in the stomach, and the heat wave followed. Amazing, Dieter exclaimed. Even if he hadn't caught the flame and attacked, he could clearly feel the fiery temperature on Natsu's fist. It is not a loss to be the dragon slayer of fire. Even if it is small, it should not be underestimated. Immediately, he moved his right foot sideways to avoid the fist, and clenched his right fist to Natsu's shoulder. Chapter 10, Win. Thanks for the monthly pass of people go tea cool. Boom. The fist hit Natsu directly in the shoulder, knocking him out to the ground. But before he could speak, Natsu, who fell to the ground, stood up again. I'm getting serious. Natsu patted the dust on his body, and put his fists on his waist with his horse steps. Woohoo. The flames erupted and two groups of fiery flames wrapped their fists to increase their destructive power and rushed again. Amazing, this kid actually knows how to use the explosive power of flames to attack. He understands so much at a young age, but how big is he when he grows up? Macau also plays with fire, and is naturally clear about the characteristics of flames. Seeing Natsu's skillful use of the explosive force of flames to continue his attack, he also admired his fighting spirit. It's pretty good, but it's impossible to beat Dieter even like that. Wakab responded with a cigarette in his mouth. Duel. Dieter doesn't look down on anyone. Not even a young Natsu, so he was serious and careful to avoid his fists. Look for opportunities to win with one hit. Once again staggering Natsu's attack, Dieter was planning to shoot, but found a slyness in Natsu's eyes. No right away that something is wrong. Fire dragons. Iron fist. I saw Natsu's fists collide. A red magic circle appeared in front of him and the flames of his right fist burned towards Dieter. Everyone in the guild was heartbroken. Everyone couldn't help but worry that Dieter would capsize. This sudden move also made them unexpected, and if they were on the field, there might be hit. Iron block. Can Dieter do it? As someone who knows the magic of Fire Dragon Slayer very well, he is always on guard against possible moves. Seeing that Natsu used magic, he immediately opened his hands and used iron blocks while stomping on horses. The body instantly became extremely hard. Boom! Exclamation mark. The fist and the chest collided making a dull sound like hitting an iron block. Wow ah ah. Natsu was bounced off instantly. He got up from the ground and rubbed his fists in a hurry, constantly shaking it to relieve the pain. Everyone around was relieved. It's okay, I thought Dieter was going to capsize in the gutter, but I didn't expect his reaction speed to be quite fast. Wakaba wiped off the sweat that didn't exist, and said with lingering fears. Mokau next to him also breathed a sigh of relief. Yeah. The move just now was really unexpected. If it was me, I wouldn't even dare to fight hard. The other guild members also spoke one after another. Dieter's strength is becoming more and more unfathomable. And that move, Fire Dragon's Iron Fist, is also very powerful. I didn't expect Dieter to be able to resist without changing his face. Yeah, even if Dieter hasn't shot for a year, it's not to be underestimated. It's amazing. Originally, I wanted to try to challenge Dieter, but now I think about it, I don't want to go to abuse. Dot. The members of the guild chatted in ear to ear. President Makarov also breathed a sigh of relief. The unexpected move just now made him a little worried. It seemed that Data hadn't neglected his practice, and the iron block was much harder than it was a year ago. Opposite, Natsu grinned and rubbed his red fists in pain. How can your body be so hard? I can't even move. Natsu asked. That hard body hardness also made him feel hit on the steel plate of pure iron. Just the force of the rebound made his fists red and painful. What he learned was dragon slaying magic and the destructive power was very strong. As a result, the punch made his arm go numb. On the other hand, the opponent is standing like nothing. Stop gossip, maybe it's over if you only have this level. Dieter patted the dust that wasn't there, watching Natsu prepare to end the fight. Damn it fire dragons. Iron fist. Naturally, Natsu was not convinced, and rushed to attack again. The flame on the fist also rose in temperature due to the change in emotion. Finger gun middle dot Huang Lian. Dieter bent his index finger and stabbed at Natsu's body with a super high speed, and changed the attacking position of the next shot left and right. Wow ah ah. Natsu screamed in pain, and was hit in many places on his body. Although Dieter restrained his attack power, he still opened several wounds, and the pain Natsu bared his teeth and cried out in pain. Whoa, whoa, fire dragon's iron fist. Natsu bears the pain. With difficulty, he rushed forward with his spare strength, and hit him with a fist that tried his best. Iron block empty wood. I said it's useless, and the fight. Dieter shook his head regretfully, his chest swelled up against his all-out fist. Boom. Whooping. Exclamation mark. Natsu's fist hit his chest, and at that moment he felt that his power was completely rebounded. In an instant, his blood surged. The body flew out and fell to the ground, 
losing his will, pity, Dieter's face was full of regret, he still had a lot of moves that he didn't use, and as a result Natsu couldn't, taking back his fighting stance, he turned around and walked towards the guild, yawning, the members of the guild were terrified, in this battle, Dieter used moves they had never seen before, not only powerful, it also seemed to make him more at ease, I've decided that I will never provoke Dieter in my life, it's too unfathomable, Dieter is really getting better and better, he hasn't done it for a year, and his magic is already different from before, scare me to death, be nice to Dieter in the future, dot, the guild members all muttered, Dieter's strength made them unable to see victory, and they no longer doubted that even if a guild member joined in the future, they would definitely not be Dieter's opponent, he will be the eldest brother among his peers, chapter 11, a very difficult delegation mission, ask for flowers, a reward, and an evaluation ticket, at the same time, Grey also admired it even more, in the battle just now, Dieter also showed enough fees, and he dealt with Natsu Kid in an understatement, this brighter admiration glowed in his eyes, it's too powerful, and I still haven't cultivated enough, Grey was excited, having seen Dieter's more powerful skills, Grey decided to practice hard, and strive to be as powerful as Dieter one day, after speaking, he turned and walked towards the guild, Kana, who was drinking, also blushed and looked at Natsu, who fainted on the ground, and turned to enter the guild, she suddenly thought that if Dieter could help her practice, she might soon be able to become an S-class mage, and she would say her identity out loud in front of that man, thinking of this, the emotions are also excited, the same is true, Erzo admired Dieter even more when he saw Dieter walking towards the guild, sure enough, strong men are more attractive, Makarov walked up to Natsu, and after checking the injury, he complained, this kid, it's not serious, at the same time, I also admire Dieter's current strength is really getting stronger and stronger, at present, it has been regarded as the top combat power of the guild, in my heart, I decided to start the assessment in two days, just to let my grandson Agosis know not to underestimate anyone, dot, within the guild, you, Erza sat beside him thoughtfully, his eyes filled with curiosity, wanting to ask something, Dieter took a glass of juice and drank it, wiped the corner of his mouth with his sleeve and asked, anything you want to ask, Erza nodded and asked after sorting out the language, you obviously haven't cultivated, but your strength is still so strong, is there any special way to improve it, she thinks that cultivation is also very hard, but after a year, Dieter's strength was still so terrifying, she felt that there was a big gap, even though she wasn't interested in being the eldest among her peers, Dieter was getting stronger fast enough to throw her too far, I, wow I am going to duel with you, Dieter was about to say two words of hard work when he was interrupted, I saw that Natsu, who should have fainted, was now awake, and rushed into the guild and shouted at Dieter, you're not giving up, Dieter's mouth twitched, this Natsu is really a Xiaokiang who can't be killed, and he wakes up so fast, it's really full of energy, seeing Natsu making a fuss about making a decision with Data again, Grey also sighed, he tried to substitute in the duel just now, but the result was the same as Natsu, and he would be beaten with no power to fight back, in addition, after Sinko will never wake up in such a short period of time, there is some urgency in my heart, I don't want to fight Data, at least I want to fight Natsu, the other members of the guild quietly watched Natsu make a fuss, no matter how he played, it was impossible for Natsu to beat Data, just ignore them, the client, Dieter, was upset by the noise, he got up from his seat and walked towards the commission column, intending to take a commission and leave the guild so as not to be pestered by Natsu every day, yo are you going to take the entrusted mission, Makarov greeted, Dieter nodded, I don't want to be pestered by Natsu every day, so let's do the entrusted task and leave, Makarov nodded, looking at the tasks on the commission column and also recommended, these commissions are of different difficulty, if you are alone, do some simple commission tasks, if you have a partner, you may choose a higher level, commission of remuneration, he now has a rough judgment on dieter's strength, it can be said that most of the commissions on the first floor are sufficient to complete, of course, given dieter's age, he also wanted someone to be with him, am I with you, after hearing Makarov's words, Erza walked over, the people eating in the guild couldn't help but stop what they were doing, and looked at Erza and dieter with a strange look, Erza has done 100% commissions so far, and he is also one of the fastest growing members in the guild, dieter's strength is very strong, and Urza is also the same, I can't believe what it would be like for these two to do commissions together, I don't think even the most difficult assignments will be a problem, right, dot, the members of the guild were clamoring for it, even Makarov was a little surprised, apart from the S rank majors, Dieter and Urza were among the most powerful members of the guild, if these two people form a team, even if it is a request on the second floor, it will be fine, right, also, Dieter didn't refuse, he reached out and grabbed a request and handed it over to Urza, asking her to check it out and prepare to travel together. Everyone in the guild was very curious about the entrustment of the two people, he couldn't help but focus his eyes on the commission, a quest to destroy the devil. Mukau was surprised when he saw the content of the quest. What? Wakaba suddenly exclaimed, 
and immediately walked in three steps and two steps, staring at the content of the commission, and said with a heavy face, This commission is very difficult. Mokao's reconsideration, this is the most difficult commission on the first floor. It has been posted in the guild for three months and no one dares to do it. This commission can even be rated to the point that only S-level mages can complete it. I heard that the commission was to destroy the demons suppressed in a church in a certain village. It's very dangerous. Grey also spoke with lingering fears. Chapter 12, The Devil's Soul of Satan, Ask for Flowers, a Reward, and an Evaluation Ticket. Are you sure you want to do this entrusted mission? Macruff asked seriously. This entrustment was originally intended to be transferred to the second floor for S-rank mages to do it. It's not that he doesn't like Data and Urza. The main reason is that this task is also very difficult, especially that demon. Legend has it that it is a demon named Satan. Even if only the soul is suppressed, it is not something that a magician can handle. No one has done this commission in the past three months, which is enough to prove how difficult it is. Even though Dieter and Urza's strengths are progressing rapidly, it's probably not enough to deal with demons. It's okay, Dieter said confidently. He doesn't care whether the devil is a devil or not. Since it can be suppressed. It means that it is not enough now. This commission still needs people to do it. Uncle Jadus is not here, so naturally someone will go. Urza said beside him. Demons are indeed scary. But she is more willing to believe in Dieter's strength, and even if she really can't be eliminated, she can get out completely. Makarov was silent. Seeing that the two of them were so determined to do the task, they simply agreed, waving their hands and warning them seriously. Remember, come back in time if there is danger. Fairy tale can't be without you, children. Don't be brave. Dieter's eyes were dazed and at this moment Makarov was kindly caring for them like a father. This emotion also made him go back to his previous life. The kind of family relationship with family also climbed to my heart. Okay, Dieter nodded, turned around and walked towards the staff dormitory, planning to go back to pack up. The same goes for Urza. After the two left, the guild members all spoke. In a year, Dieter has become more and more responsible. Macau sighed while drinking. Thinking back a year ago, Dieter was a little kid who just came to the guild and now he has grown into the reliable boy. Not only is he responsible, but his strength is also getting stronger and stronger, and it feels like we will get rid of our old predecessors in an instant. Wakaba took a deep breath and immersed himself in the smoke. There are more and more people in the guild, and the strength of each one has become stronger, which is indeed a happy thing. Grey scratched his head. It's just a demon. There's no danger that Data and Urza join forces. Wow damn it, I'm going to duel him. Natsu frowned. Grey rolled the eyes of the dead fish and complained, you spitting fire. You know you can't beat him. But you're going to die. Exhibitionist. Let's fight. Boring. Hang-eyed man. You bastard. Exhibitionist. Dang-eyed man. Let's fight. Ha 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 I'm going to beat you to death. Dot. Magnolia Station. Dieter stared blankly at Urza, who was dragging a lot of luggage by his side. What? Urza looked uncomfortable and asked, is there something wrong? Dieter pointed at the whole car of luggage she was pulling, and said speechlessly, what's the matter with your hobby? Do you have to prepare so much luggage every time you do a task? And Urza looked at his luggage and tilted his head for a while, puzzled, shouldn't you just bring luggage when you go out? That said, Dieter was powerless to complain. I want to refute, but there is really no place to justify it. It is true that you need to bring luggage when you go out, only, forget it, don't worry about it. Shaking his head, he didn't continue to answer the call, and got on the train after the train stopped. Sit down when you find a spot. The two picked up the entrusted task again and checked it out. The target of this mission is a demon soul named Satan. Urza said, Dieter suddenly interrupted and asked in surprise, What's going on? Satan's demon soul? No wonder Dieter thinks too much, as the Satan in the fairy tale world, what he knows best is Mira Jane who has receiving magic. That is a very good looking and quite attractive woman. She has an angelic face, and when she is gentle, she is Mira Jane, a lovely waiter, and when she is fighting, she is Mira Jane, a powerful and terrifying S-class magician demon. Her strength is one of the best in the entire guild. Yes, it is said that this Satan was suppressed in a certain church. He is very powerful and has a different form. Urza nodded. Here Dieter to go silent here. He didn't know whether it was right or wrong to destroy Satan's soul in the past at this moment. If it is eliminated now, does it mean that Mira Jane's first receiving form is about to disappear? And does it mean that Mira Jane cannot enter the fairy tale guild at an absurd point? So cute and good looking sister flowers want to live outside? Well... I think there may be a problem with this commission. Let's go over and take a look. Dieter spoke seriously. Before confirming the whereabouts of Mira Jane and others, try not to contact Satan's soul. All right. Urza didn't think much of it. Continue to talk to Dieter about the process of this mission, and also make a series of plans. If you can't get rid of it at that time, you can also withdraw and leave in time. Safety is the most important. Although she believed in Dieter's strength, she was not afraid of 10,000, and she had to be prepared. Chapter 13, The Village That Suppressed the Demon Satan. Ask for flowers, 
ask for an evaluation ticket. Chapter 13, The Village That Suppressed the Demon Satan The train galloped on the track, walked through every city station. A certain village, Dieter and Erzak come to a village to suppress the demon Satan. You are the wizards from the fairy tale guild, at the entrance of the village. The village chief looked at Dieter and Erzak in front of him with a strong suspicion in his eyes. Even sent two children. It seems that fairy tale, the first guild, is nothing more than that. Yes, we are the wizards sent by fairy tale. Can the village chief take us into the village? Dieter introduced modestly. He didn't refute the suspicion and contempt in the village chief's eyes. No matter how the two children refute, it is impossible to attract attention, it is better to directly prove their identity with strength. Okay, come with me, you two. The village chief agreed. After all, it was the person sent by fairy tale, and the most basic reception etiquette was indispensable. He turned around and led the way and led Dieter and Urza into the village. The two followed behind and looked around. Dieter wants to see if he can find the Mira Jane sisters three can't. He didn't know where Mira Jane's hometown was, but he wanted to be able to obtain Satan's soul, and when he was still very young, he should be a local. The people here don't seem to sleep well at night, Urza whispered. Although the village chief in front is old, his hearing is still very good. After hearing Urza's words, he also explained the reason. A long time ago, the devil Satan was suppressed by the church, but in recent months, Satan's roar has become louder and louder, making the people in the village unable to eat or sleep well. The fairy tale guild sent people to destroy the demons, I never thought. I didn't say anything later, but I could hear that the village chief resented the two children sent by the fairy tale guild. Dieter ignored the ignorant village chief. He continued to look at the people in the village, trying to find the three Mira Jane figures. Unfortunately, until the village chief brought the two of them to find a place to rest, they could not find it. The two of you, please rest here, and if you need anything, just tell me. After the village chief settled the two, he turned and left. There was absolutely no hope for Dieter and Erda. People go. Dieter swept across the corner of the room and sat down and thought. Wait until we get there tonight? Erda asked. After all, the devil Satan is very dangerous. Since he came here, he must do his best to entrust him. Time waits for no one. In order to let the people in the village eat and sleep well, he decided to wait until the evening to go to the church to destroy the devil Satan. Okay, Dieter agreed. It was no longer a matter of Dieter doing what he wanted. Since he had accepted this request, he had to do what he had to do. Even if Mira Jane couldn't join the guild because of it, the whole village could not continue to panic. At the same time, inside a house in the corner of the village, silver white hair is the most striking feature of this family. Sister, are we really going? Elfman asked. My sister just decided to help the village eliminate the monster in the church, but that monster is the legendary devil Satan. Even if there are only remnants left, they are not able to deal with it brother, we have to trust my sister, the whole village can't rest well because of that monster's noise, as a member of the village, you can't just sit back and ignore it, listener sat on the other side with clean short hair, and Mira Jane with a bow on his head nibbled at the hard biscuits in his hand, and said angrily, of course I will go, that monster that I don't know what it is is so noisy that people can't sleep, why don't you get rid of such a monster and stay there, you guys trust me, but, I heard that the village chief has asked a magician to help, Elfman was still a little worried, it's enough to have a magician to do it in person, and it's better to let someone with strength handle this kind of thing, brother, why are you so cowardly, instead of relying on others, it is better to rely on yourself, we can definitely get rid of the demon monster first, and prove that we are not weaker than the sorcerer, listener smiled, she chose to believe unconditionally about her sister, no sorcerer is definitely inferior to his sister, and he must be able to get rid of the demon in the church. Mira Jane nodded with satisfaction, took a gulp of hot water next to her, and hurriedly continued to take a bite of the hard biscuits, saying, it is better to rely on yourself than others. The sorcerer will leave one day. Do you have to rely on others when you encounter difficulties? On his face was a righteous and awe-inspiring self-confidence. Only when we become stronger can we protect the village. Well, listener and Elfman looked excited, obviously overwhelmed by what their sister Mira Jane said. Dot. Chapter 14. Six Types of Profound Truth. Six King's Spear. Seeking flowers. Night falls. Everyone in the village immediately put down their work when the sun went down. Hide in your own house, turn off the lights, and fall asleep early. They all know that the devil Satan will make a miserable roar at night, and they will go to sleep in time to be physically busy tomorrow. At this moment, the village where there were still human figures fell into extreme silence. Dieter and Urza climbed the wall from the residence. The surrounding silence did not even sound the sound of crickets which was a bit strange. It seems that the people here are very afraid of being tortured by the devil Satan. Dieter stepped forward and Urza followed closely, terrified from her nervous little face. Geek. As soon as he took a step, he heard something flash, and Urza grabbed Dieter's arm nervously. After all, she's just a teenage girl, and it's normal to be afraid of the dark night. Dieter took her to the direction of the church without leaving a trace, and the road was always guarded against possible dangers. Creek Tilda opened the door of the church, the interior is a dark environment, it's not an exaggeration to call it out of sight. Raw! Exclamation mark. 
Sudden, a roar resounded through the valley. The airwaves caused by the cry were like a violent storm, and the church door swayed and made a strange creaking sound. All the people in the village could not help but tighten their quilts and tremble. The surrounding small animals also hid in the nest blood and shivered. The two in the church were even more shocked. Isn't that a bit too loud? Dieta muttered. Originally, the elder of the association said that the devil Satan was very scary. He didn't believe it. But now it really surprised him. Just the power of the roar made his clothes rattle. There are faint signs of being blown away from the body. The air wave that the roar raised was so terrifying. Next to Erda, he raised his arm to cover his pale face and squeezed Dieter's palm tightly with the other hand, and his body began to slide back in the roar. Quick fight, Dieter ordered. After waiting for the air wave to stop, he rushed towards the depths of the church. No matter what, he still needed to see the devil Satan first. Church backyard. Following the source of the voice Dieter and Urza quickly pinpointed the location of the demon Satan. It's underground. Dieter was surprised. I never thought that this church still has other things, and there is probably a secret room underground. Are you looking for an agency? Maybe it's too late. Urza hurriedly asked. Dieter shook his head directly. It is too difficult to find the mechanism, and the underground Satan is likely to continue to call, and the roar of that level is too dangerous. It is better to attack directly. Get out of the way and I'll break the ground, Dieter ordered. Urza had to take a quick step back, watching Dieter wonder what he was going to do. Moonstep, Dieter thought, and his body immediately leapt towards the heights. By the moonlight for a while, the figure was so small that it was almost invisible. What are you going to do? Urza thought. I don't know how deep the basement is. In this case, looking for a mechanism is the best way. The method of breaking through the ground by force seems simple but it is not clear how much force it will actually take. If you use it too small, you won't be able to break the ground, and it will waste your power. If you use too much force, it may be affected nearby. Six Styles Razor, Dieter's body fell, and he continued to accelerate in the air with a fusion of moon steps and shaving. The strong winds and waves around him blew him. It was getting closer and closer to the ground, and it was about to fall to the ground. At this time, Dieter clenched his fist tightly, constantly gathering strength on the fist. The blue veins on the back of his hand swelled up, and the whitish phalanx fully indicated that the power of this attack was definitely not weak. Six types of profound truth, six king's spear, boom, exclamation mark. Ka ka ka, exclamation mark. The earth was shaking, and the entire church building was shaken by the impact of this fist. As the closest person, Urza fell to the ground by the shaking. It was also very shocking to see the crack centered on Dieter's fist. This punch was so powerful, too strong. Urza couldn't help but exclaim. Everyone in the guild knows that Dieter is very strong and no one of his age can beat him, but everyone can never imagine that Dieter's strength is probably enough to become an S-rank mage. Careful, Dieter suddenly exclaimed. A shaved came to Urza's body, grabbed her without waiting for her to ask questions, and stepped into the air. Boom! Exclamation mark. Urza was just about to ask, when the ground collapsed and the basement was clearly exposed to the night light. But it's not over yet. With the collapse of the ground, the walls of the church climbed into cracks, which were particularly dazzling in the dark night. Ba ba ba. Suddenly, Dieter and Urza both heard voices coming from inside the church. Could it be that someone was in the church at the time? Hey, what did the two of you do? There's dust everywhere, don't pay attention at all. Three figures came out of the back door of the church, and at the head was a little girl who looked like a bad girl, followed by the slightly shy listener and the goofy-looking elfman. Mira Jane? Dieter muttered. Sure enough, this Mira Jane is really in this village, but I haven't seen anyone before. The purpose of their coming here at this time. Chapter 15. Six Types of Profound Truth. Biggest Wheel. Six King's Spear! Exclamation mark! Ask for flowers! Ask for an evaluation ticket! Roar! Exclamation mark! The roar of the demon Satan broke Dieter's guess. Immediately told the three of Mira Jane, hide away immediately. The next battle will spread to you. As soon as the voice fell, he took Kaiser and fell towards the deep hole that exploded. Boom dash! War is imminent. Mira Jane three people outside have looked dumbfounded. Amazing! Mira Jane was surprised. That magical magic made her very envious and being able to fly can also cause such power. Sister, let's go. The roar made listener's body tremble with fear, and she grabbed her sister's arm to persuade. Yeah, sister, we can't beat that demon monster at all, so let's leave quickly. Elfman also said. Mira Jane, however, stared at the two men in the pothole who joined forces to fight against the demonic phantom. Excited to get involved. No. I want to go down to help. I can't let those two die. Listener, you and Elfman go first, and I'll go back when I go. Mira Jane ordered. He broke free from the obstruction of his younger brother and sister and walked towards the deep pit. She had a gut feeling that if she didn't go on, she might lose something very important. So some don't care. Below, the battle went on quickly, and the strength of the demon Satan's soul should not be underestimated. Dieter and Urza were defeated steadily. Dieter, we're going to withdraw, 
This demon is much stronger than I thought. Urza was beaten out again, and the Namam also showed that the current demon was far beyond the expected judgment. Wait, Dieta frowned. The power of this devil Satan is indeed strong, but it is not invincible. What is lacking now is the opportunity. An attacking opportunity. I'm here to help you. At this point Mira Jane came down from above and charged towards him with a stick in his hand. Urza was shocked, and yelled with red eyes, What are you doing here? Are you going to die? The darkness of Tower of Heaven made her watch the tragic situation of her peers, and when she saw Mira Jane coming over, she couldn't help but worry that the tragedies of the past could happen again. Good chance, Dieter has been keeping an eye on the ghost of the demon Satan. When Mira Jane came down from the outside, the demon Satan moved somewhat slowly, and he sees the opportunity. Shave. Apostrophe. When the Navy Sixth Form was used, Dieter's figure immediately rushed in front of the devil Satan. Both hands clenched and aimed at the big guy in front of him. Six style profound truth. Biggest wheel, six king's spear. The blow dieter used all his strength to gather and release it. Boom! Exclamation mark. Rumble! Exclamation mark. The super strong shockwave penetrated the soul of the devil Satan and directly affected the damage on the soul body. Instantly defeat the demon Satan, and the aftermath of the six king's spear directly hit the underground wall behind Satan. More violent shaking went through the entire village. Those who were awakened curiously opened the door to a gap. He stared at the direction of the church with fear. Boom! Just as their eyes watched. Cracks in the walls of the entire church continued to spread. When it spread to the whole building, the ancient church full of history collapsed and turned into ruins under a turbulent dust. All the villagers rushed out of their houses in horror. What's going on? How could the church collapse? Could it be that the demon monster has regained its freedom? What the hell happened tonight? The church turned into ruins. Devil. It must be the devil who is reborn, and will slaughter our village next. Run. You must run quickly. No. I don't want to die. An atmosphere of panic spread from the villagers. Everyone was scared and wanted to go home and pack up and leave the village overnight. Ruin scene. Dieter wasn't too happy. At this moment, the body was a little tired and slumped on the ground, watching the soul that had just been shattered by himself begin to condense again. As expected of the devil Satan, this immortality is really tricky. Dieter complained. Urza stepped forward and came to his side, lifted Dieter up and said, You've worked so hard, we have to leave now. Dieter didn't speak, and turned his head to look at Mira Jane. You had been absent from the beginning. Less than three seconds. I saw Mira Jane striding towards the devil Satan. Urza was about to stop when he was pulled by Dieter, intending to look down. Mira Jane absent-mindedly walked in front of the demon Satan, raised her arm and aimed at the still condensing soul. Suddenly, the devil Satan is constantly struggling. It seemed that something terrible was constantly absorbing it. But the weak soul body was still unable to resist that power, and the whole soul body poured into Mira Jane's body. What? At the same time Mira Jane woke up from her absence, scratching her head strangely. This. What's going on? The demon disappeared, but Urza was in doubt. It stands to reason that the terrifying demon was still alive, but why did it disappear? And Dieter was relieved. Just now he was betting on whether Mira Jane would take over that demon Satan. No doubt he was right. Ah my arm. Mira Jane felt something different. The swelling and pain in her arm changed, and it slowly turned into a pair of arms that were not human. Urza, who was guarding Dieter, immediately clenched the sword in his hand. Alert. Chapter 16. Embrace the magic Mira Jane, ask for flowers, ask for an evaluation ticket. Elder sister, sister, are you alright? Elfman and Lisney above heard the sound and got down immediately. When he saw Mira Jane's arms, his forward stance suddenly stopped, and his heart skipped a beat when he saw those arms that were not human. This. How could my sister's arm be? Lisney asked. Elfman looked at Dieta and Urza with red eyes, and asked, what the hell did you do to my sister? Hearing Elfman's words, Urza frowned and was a little displeased, but also knew that he was just concerned and messed up, and didn't explain it to him. Instead, he looked at Dieter. Dieter, you know what? This question also made the three Mira Jane siblings look at him. Dieter nodded, looked at Mira Jane and said, Congratulations on becoming a sorceress. Sorcerer? Magician. The Mira Jane siblings were puzzled. Urza was a little surprised. She didn't expect that the change in the girl's arm was because of the sorcerer, only, with a strange face. He said, what kind of magic does this belong to? Mira Jane also listened curiously. Sorcerers belong to the Sorcerer's Guild. They are a group of people with extraordinary power, and it is also the place she yearns for. At this time, she also has a hunger for her own changes. The four people who were there for a while turned into well-behaved students, waiting for Dieter's answer from the teacher. Magicians refer to a group of people who can use magic, and most mages need to join the Wizard's Guild. Urza and I came from the Fairy Tale Wizard's Guild. The magic power in each person is limited. Although the total amount of magic power can be enhanced through later training, all magicians are proficient in magic. There are many kinds of magic in the world. For example, my comrade Urza, she learns dressing magic. Urza next to him nodded, 
and summoned several different longswords from the different space to cooperate with Diata's teaching. The three mirror Jane on the opposite side also learned about the world of mages for the first time. Transformation magic is magic that can summon weapons stored in a magical space anytime, anywhere to fight. And your magic belongs to receiving magic. Diata was careful but didn't say whether or not individuals could learn different kinds of magic, because he can't figure it out either. Receive magic? Is it the kind of magic that receives monster or animal power? Urza asked. The three people on the other side continued to listen carefully. Dieter nodded. Yes, it can receive the power of monsters or animals and use it for itself. This kind of magic can be divided into two categories. Partial reception which only accepts part of the target's body and whole body reception which fully receives the target. Mira Jane, like a student, raised her hand and asked. Then I am a partial acceptance? The two arms turned into monsters, which is the same as the state of partial reception, that should be the case. However, Dieter shook his head, no, receiving magic can be freely switched between the two forms. Your current state is because you are not familiar with this kind of magic, so it will become like this. When you join the guild in the future, someone will specifically teaching you how to master this ability. Erzo immediately understood why Dieter was talking in such detail. Although she is still young, she is still very smart and knows her plan to do so. You're amazing. You know so much, and you're about the same age as me. Mira Jane's face was filled with admiration, but she quickly dimmed, the sorceress guild, I have a younger brother and sister to take care of. It was time for Urza to speak. She walked up to Mira Jane and extended her hand to invite, come on, come to fairy tale, all three of you can join. Dot. Within the village, the village chief led a group of villagers around the door where Diata and Urza were resting. One of the villagers said uncertainly, those two children have already escaped. Fairy tale sent two children here and I'm afraid I didn't intend to let them complete the unreturned task. The family members of the villager beside him also muttered, I'm afraid I'm already dead. The village chief's face was full of anger. He was also very angry when he heard the words of the villagers, and scolded them harshly. You shut up, since you're sent by the fairy tale guild, you must show enough respect and wait for them to come out of the door. After hearing what the village chief said, the villagers were reluctant. But no one came out for such a long time, maybe he ran away long ago. That's right. The earthquake and the screams were so loud just now, no matter how deep you sleep, you should wake up. Yeah, yeah, it's better to go directly to find it. The villagers were already full of complaints about fairy tale sending two children, which would naturally be impossible to respect. After being told by their words, the village chief also wanted to go in and have a look. You are. At this time, Dieter brought Erza to the residence, and saw that the whole village was here, and was a little curious for a while. After hearing the sound. The villagers and the village chief looked at it. When I saw that the people who came were the two children sent by fairy tale, the atmosphere couldn't help condensing. That dot 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 why didn't the two of you rest at home? The village chief asked hurriedly. Dieta shrugged strangely. We just went to deal with the demon monster, of course we can't be at home. Hiss. The cool air in the air was sucked away by the villagers. They all looked at the two children in front of them in horror, their brains running fast. Did you just deal with the demon monster? So that means they caused the roars and earthquakes before? That's kind of scary. The village chief's heart beat faster and his face turned red and asked, Then that earthquake just now, Dieta admitted it indifferently, nodded and replied, Yes, the earthquake just now is the aftermath of our battle with the demon monsters. I'm sorry to disturb everyone's rest. Silent. And it's quiet. The villagers couldn't help but stagnate, and when they took another breath, the air was a lot dignified. I was fighting the devil just now. The aftermath of the battle made the village feel the earthquake and even destroyed the church! Exclamation mark. This is too scary. Obviously there are two children, why do they have such terrifying strength? And at this time, when they appeared here, doesn't it mean that the demon that tortured them for several months has disappeared? Exclamation mark. The devil dot 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 the devil is gone. The village chief was breathing rapidly. Desperately want to know the ending. Yeah, the demon is very strong, but our fairy tale guild is much more powerful, and has been eliminated by us. Dieter replied calmly. Uproar. All the people could not help but lose their voices. They looked at Data and Urza in shock, surprise, or amazement. The scalp stared numbly. Even if there are people in their hearts who keep denying it and don't want to believe it, the result will make them feel terrified. Fairy tale is indeed the strongest guild. Even two ten-year-old children have this kind of shocking strength. It's getting late, everyone rest early, we should go back tomorrow. Data didn't mind their surprise. Take Urza through the crowd back home to rest, leaving a group of stunned people! Exclamation mark. Chapter 17, Mirror Jane Satan's Strength Ask for flowers, ask for an evaluation ticket. The next day, thanks to the villagers, Dieter and Urza left the village with their pay. After meeting with Mira Jane and the three of them outside the village, they headed back the way they came. Dieter, teach me how to practice magic. I want to grow up quickly. Mira Jane added, and then beat you. Um, Dieter, who was leading the way, was stunned. Doubtful looking at the bad girl Mira Jane, it is understandable to teach cultivation. 
But what kind of weird idea you have to beat me, little girl, your way is narrow. Forget it. Dieta was speechless, if I teach you, we can go back slower. As for defeating me, don't have such thoughts. Mira Jane doesn't care so much, she only knows that Dieta promised to help her practice, and happily agreed, okay. Erza smiled at Dieta, and sure enough he was still charming. Dot. Magnolia, Fairy Tale Guild. After a long journey that lasted a month, Dieta and his party of five finally came back. Standing at the door. Mira Jane three people were warmly welcomed, welcome to Fairy Tale. Listener and Elfman looked at the guild gate a little nervously, worried about whether they could join the guild, even Dieter must have been a little skeptical many times. Mira Jane, on the other hand, is a lot more enthusiastic, with a bright light in his eyes. He immediately stepped forward and opened the guild door. Ha ha ha, hello Fairy Tale, I'm here to kick the gym. Mira Jane laughed. The members of the house were stunned. Turning his head, he looked at Mira Jane, the bad girl at the door. With a little surprise, Dieta stepped forward with a headache, patted Mira Jane on the shoulder, and took the initiative to step into the guild. Yo I'm back. Welcome back. You kid should be on a date with Erta, he's only coming back in a month. Why are all the young people now so precocious? Ha ha, you're making a fuss again, Dieta. Dot. After seeing Dieta back, the guild members welcomed him warmly. Natsu also jumped out immediately, shouting, Dieta, let's duel. Clam, where's the kid? Mira Jane jumped out from behind staring at Natsu with contempt. Dieta laughed and walked to the president. Yo good old man, Dieta greeted with a grin. President Makarov nodded in relief. You did a good job, you can deal with the devil Satan. Very good. However, Dieta's face changed dramatically before he could be humble, and he picked up a few pieces of paper and handed them to him, but... Did you go too far, you demolished other people's churches, and you didn't honestly destroy several shops on the way back? Dot. Dieta looked embarrassed. He scratched his head and said aggrievedly, the church itself is in disrepair, and if it doesn't fall in any better, someone can build something better, and there's that shop where the bosses even said that I'm a little kid who doesn't deserve to fish. I can't stand my temper. Erza looked at Mira Jane arguing with Natsu, and Delfman and Lisna restrained behind him. Looking at Dieta who was confronting the president again, his mood improved a lot. It's good here. Damn it. You are arrogant, kid. Makarov and Dieta blushed and said angrily, what's going on with those three little guys? Dieta stopped arguing and recounted everything that happened in the church at that time. Receive magic, receive demon Satan. Makarov was surprised, looking at the bad girl Mira Jane and nodded with satisfaction. It looks like a girl with unlimited potential. There. The quarrel has heated up. Come out with me, little brat. I'm going to teach you a good lesson. Mira Jane, the bad girl, invited her to fight in a frenzy. Natsu was not afraid, and raised his neck to fight back. Fight if you fight, I will teach you a good lesson. The two walked outside. Dieta also laughed and followed suit. Mira Jane was not so kind when she was a child. Makarov and other members of the guild also followed, intending to see how powerful the new girl was. Outside, Dieta stood beside Makarov, waiting for the battle to end. Hey, Dieta, guess who'll win? Makau hurriedly asked. Dieta responded without hesitation. Mira Jane, Natsu won't last long in her hands. No way. Wakaba was surprised. Although Natsu was very small, he was actually very strong, and now Dieta said he was vulnerable. Even Grey, Kana and President Makarov was surprised by Dieter's affirmation. How is it possible, even if the little girl received the power of the devil Satan, how could it be possible to beat Natsu in a month? Makarov didn't believe it. The strength of receiving magic depends entirely on the upper limit of the target being received. The stronger the reception is, the stronger the strength will be in a later stage. The devil Satan is indeed outrageously strong, but after only a month, it is impossible to use the full power of the devil Satan. Everyone else thinks so. But Dieter also sighed when he thought about the practice this month. You can't imagine how talented she is, and her learning ability and talent in cultivation are definitely not weaker than Erda. Jild members questioned, and the battle in front of you has just begun. Little kid, don't blame me for not giving face. As long as you can hold on for five minutes, I'll admit defeat. Mira Jane said, stand still and close your eyes to use magic. Receive magic, Satan's soul. Q. Utilda, as the magic received, a wave of air blew around Mira Jane. A dark black magic circle appeared above her head. At that moment, Mira Jane finished receiving. The bad girl has disappeared, replaced by Mira Jane Satan with demon arms, some lines on her body, and a tail behind her. Go to hell, Mira Jane said coldly. He stepped on the ground and rushed towards Natsu, with a qualitative leap in speed and strength. The guild members were also dumbfounded. They stared at Mira Jane who was beating Natsu in disbelief. Bang bang bang. Clap clap clap. Ethilda, let alone five minutes, under Mira Jane's beating. Natsu didn't even hold on for a minute. The beaten body screamed in pain. Too weak. Mira Jane withdrew her magic after saying a word, gasping for breath and wiping the sweat on her forehead. Brother Dieter has been helping me with my practice this month. I thought you would be strong, 
But that's what happened, hiss. Everyone in the guild gasped with a toothache. I'm going why did you come back in the past two years? Those who joined the guild are all such terrifying little monsters. This girl is actually taught by Dieter himself. He is too powerful. I'm convinced. Dieter is not only a little monster himself, but the apprentices he taught are also little monsters. They were completely overwhelmed. Dieter's own strength is super strong, and now even his apprentices are so strong. He deserves to be the boss of his age. Impressed. Everyone in the guild was really convinced. Even Makarov admired it. At the same time, the idea in my mind is constantly growing. Time to start. S-Class Mage Examination! Exclamation mark. Chapter 18. S-Class Mage Examination. Ask for evaluation ticket. Ask for flowers. Ask for reward. Days pass by. In the blink of an eye, winter and spring come and go. Mira Jane has long been a member of the guild with her younger brother and sister. And he and Urza became rivals and the reason for becoming rivals turned out to be who has a good relationship with Dieter, question mark. Urza also integrated into the guild under the harassment of three naughty guys, Mira Jane, Grey, and Natsu, and is no longer so lonely. Dieter once again became a frequent visitor to the sea fishing at the guild gate. This day, Dieter, who had planned to continue fishing, found that the atmosphere in the guild was a little different. Squeezed between Urza and Mira Jane and asked curiously, what happened to the guild today? It seems to be a little different, everyone seems to be very Enthusiastic, Mira Jane shook her head. All she knew was fighting Urza. She didn't care about anything else. Or Urza explained to Dieta, I heard that the president is going to announce the assessment staff of S-class mages today. I don't know who they are. S-rank mage exam? Dieta was surprised. Of course Dieta knew it for the past few years after joining the guild, but it was never held because there were no staff. Does it mean that someone has met the requirements for the assessment? Who will it be? The other members of the guild are very gossipy in discussions. It's time for the S-class mages assessment again. This year, Lagosas will definitely be eligible to participate. There should be other people. If there is only one person, there is no need to hold such an event. It's good to directly promote the candidate to become an S-rank mage. I feel like Dieter would be a good fit too. Maybe he'll be in the two. I don't think so. The requirements for S-rank mages are mission completion and strength. Naturally, there is nothing to say about strength, but the mission. Yeah, that should be Urza. Dot. The people in the guild are very interested in this kind of guessing candidates. After analyzing everyone in the guild, it is possible that only one of the three Dieter, Urza, and Mira Jane will end up. It should be you. Dieter looked at Urza and added, you are the best in terms of strength and mission completion. Neither Mira Jane nor me. Damn it. Mira Jane was dissatisfied clenching her fists and staring at Urza with fiery eyes. The next second she stepped on the table, Urza, let's fight. Another day, Urza shook his head, I think it should be you Dieter and Lagosas. About this Dieter smiled wryly, in his heart, he was reluctant to take part in the S-rank mage exam, even though he was quite strong, but if his opponent was Lagosas, he would definitely win. The main reason is that his gold finger is very unreliable. Now that he has cultivated the sixth form of the navy to level 9, but he has been unable to obtain skill points resulting in being stuck all the time. At this level, he cannot form a crushing combat power against Lagosas. He hopes that other types of means can be added sooner. But the system is not powerful. Gee what did he beat me with? Just as Urza and Dieta were communicating, a beating voice came from behind. Hey, Lagosas, are you going too far? And it's not easy for Dieta to hit you? Mira Jane immediately turned around and stepped on a stool to defend Dieta when she heard Lagosas slap. Lagosas, you should be more polite. Everyone is a companion of the guild. It's impossible for anyone like you to care about you. Urza also spoke, but Lagosas didn't really care what Urza said. Leaving the two women by mistake, the voice came in a leisurely voice. You two women better pray that you don't participate in the S-level mage exam. I will kill the flowers. F.C.K. So arrogant? Dieta couldn't sit still when he heard Lagosa's beating tone. He stood up from his seat and looked at his back. His tone became cold, and said, Lagosa's, remember what you said just now, I can't allow Urza and Mira Jane to get hurt. If you play against them, you have to be careful, if you hurt them, you're done. Ha ha, Lagosa's sneered, showing a disdainful expression, turning his head to stare at Dieta playfully. I won't show mercy when I meet you. The air is scorched. Both of them stared at each other not to be outdone dislike each other. The rest of the guild didn't know how to speak. The relationship between the two is quite bad in itself, but this time it really becomes more and more rigid. Cough cough. Just when the atmosphere froze, President Macruff came down from the upstairs and cleared his throat to draw everyone's eyes back. I think you all know that it's time for the S-rank mage exam again, Macruff said. The members of the guild had lively discussions. They are all very curious about how many places there are in this S-rank mage assessment. President, how many S-level assessors are there this year? Who else besides Lagosas? It should be Urza. She has been very good in the past few years, and she has done a good job of delegating tasks. I'm more optimistic about Myra. Maybe they will all participate. These people are very strong. I think so too. Everyone in the guild asked, 
President Makarov listened to everyone's inquiries and did not directly name the candidate. After the conversation was quiet for a while, he said, there are only two people who participated in the S rank major assessment this year. The strength of these two is obvious to all, and they are enough to take the responsibility of the S rank mage. Chapter 19, Diata vs Lagosas Thanks for the monthly pass of Dark Moonlight. 2. Everyone in the guild was a little surprised by the president's decision. In terms of strength, both Urza and Mira Jane and Diata are strong and even Grey and Natsu are rising stars. They thought that even if there were not many places, there should still be three or more qualifications. As a result, I never thought that only two S-class majors could have the qualifications for this exam. There are only two, so apart from Lagosas, the other target can only be one of Erda, Mira Jane, Grey, Natsu, and Data. Among these people, Grey and Natsu are still not good enough, and Data's words are unlikely. The strength that the president said just now is obvious to all. It means that it only depends on strength. It is definitely Data. My god, you're such a clever little devil. Dot. Anyone can say that, among them Grey and Natsu will naturally be eliminated first. The two parties had ugly expressions on their faces. You guys, Grey complained, it's so disrespectful to these people. Natsu also scratched his hair and whispered, I'm strong too, okay. Of course, the accusations of the two men went unheeded. You must know that this time it is the qualification for the S rank mage assessment, and the strength of the two people in the entire guild is really weak. Who is that man? Lagosas asked. He didn't think anyone in the guild was qualified to compare with him. Not Erta, not Mira Jane, not even Dieter. None of these people are rivals. The first one is Lagosas Dola. Makarov shouted his name. Everyone in the guild was expressionless, and of course they knew about Lagosas. What made them curious was another member. The other one is Dieter. Uproar. The members of the guild all showed expressions of sudden realization, and it was the same person they thought. The other person with the S rank qualification is really Dieter. Dieter, it really is you. Both Erza and Mira Jane are happy for him. Diet raised his brows lightly, it was necessary to escape now, and it was just the right time to hit Lagosas properly. Look at it now, Lagosas and Dieter, I don't know which of them is more powerful. Ha ha, I think Lagosas might be stronger. Lagosas is the grandson of the guild leader. Naturally, he has no talent or strength. He joined the guild since he was a child, and his strength has already belonged to the first step among the young people in the guild. Dieter is also very strong. I haven't seen him make a move for a long time. This time, I think he will show more power right? The guild members were not disappointed. In the current division of strength within the guild, Lagosas is also the strongest under the S rank mages. And Dieter is mysterious, and he doesn't usually do many commission tasks, and his strength is probably the same as Lagosas. Master, I don't know what the assessment is about. Dieter ignored the discussion among the guild members and looked at Makarov. The veins on Lagosas' forehead suddenly rose, no matter what the content is, as long as you defeat the S rank mage, it belongs to me. Makarov sighed. His grandson was in the rebellious period and he was a little undisciplined, and said, Jirdas was supposed to test you, but he didn't come back in time, so this time the test is straight. The two of you can learn from each other, who will it be? Whoever wins is S rank. The neat content also aroused the guild members' mood to watch the play. A battle of dragons and tigers is also about to be staged. Ha ha, Lagosas laughed loudly, that's great. Even Dieter was a little surprised. He didn't expect that the S rank assessment only required the assessment of strength. Compete with Lagos? Dieter has no opinion on this. Before. He was just worried that his strength was not enough to crush Lagosas. Now, since this is the case, it is also possible not to crush and win. Now Lagosas is only 17 years old. His strength may be very strong in the future, but he is still not in the eyes of Dieter. That's fine, Dieter responded. Go straight outside without paying attention to Lagosas. Since we are learning from each other, don't talk so much nonsense and come directly. Handsome. So cool, Dieter is finally going to compete with Lagosas. I've been waiting for this day for a long time. Macau drank the wine in his glass and left the guild with a smile, ready to find a suitable viewing spot first. Wakaba followed with a cigarette. Hey, Macau, wait for me. That's awesome. Natsu also laughed and ran out. Grey shook his head and followed. Kaina muttered and walked outside with a barrel of wine. Trouble, there's no way to be happy with a fight or something. Urza and Mira Jane looked at each other and headed outside. The rest of the guild also left the guild, trying to find a reliable place to watch the next battle. Chi. A bunch of trash. Lagosas cursed, clenching his fists and walking out. He was not afraid of Dieter. This time, he must know who is the first person under the S rank mages in the guild. Hey, Makarov looked at his grandson and shook his head and sighed. I don't know if Dieter can do it, but Lagosas has a super destructive thunder magic, and ordinary people are not opponents at all. Dot. Chapter 20, Devil Fruit Treasure Chest. Thanks to the three mice boss for the reward. Exclamation mark. Ding. Sign into the S level mage assessment and you will be rewarded with six skill points. Just walking out of the guild, Dieter stomped. The line of words appeared in the brain, and the long disappeared system appeared again. It's still six skill points, Dieter muttered. Without further ado, 
directly at one point to each of the six naval styles. The level of the Navy sixth form was successfully added. Full iron block, full moon step, full foot post, full paper painting, full finger gun, full shaving. Since then, the level of the Navy sixth form has been successfully filled. Treasure box. Dieter looked a little excitedly at the treasure chest above the Navy Type 6. With the full level of the Navy Type 6, the treasure chest was already lit up. Dieter goes and clicks. Insufficient skill points. It's a pity that opening the treasure chest also requires skill points. And now his skill points have been used up. If you want to open the treasure chest, you can only wait until the next time you get skill points. I. Your sister. How come the damn skill points are not enough? I don't even have a quest. The next time I get skill points, who knows when it will be. In the past few years. The Navy Type 6 has finally been upgraded to the full level. I thought it was time to open the treasure chest, but there was another reward that required skill points to open. Depressed, he looked at the treasure chest. Suddenly, Dieter found that there was a line of small words on the treasure chest at this moment, which seemed to write something, and tried to check. Devil Fruit Treasure Chest. After opening, you will randomly get a natural, superhuman, and animal devil fruit! Exclamation mark. Oh my god! Dieter was stunned. Originally he thought that this treasure chest might be the ability of other worlds. I didn't expect it to be a devil fruit. Wouldn't this be a direct blow to the sky if he obtained the devil fruit of the four emperors Whitebeard or Kaido of the beast? If you have that kind of strength, immediately fight against the black dragon Akuro Nokia and directly dominate the world. Heart is getting hotter. Dieter can't wait to get stuck in bugs to keep the system checking in, and directly upgrade to full level. Dieter, get ready to start. Just as Dieter was thinking about the future, President Macruff's voice woke him up. Take a deep breath, Dieter had no choice but to get back to the point with a hot heart. By moving his body on the spot, he could clearly feel that at this moment, his use of the sixth form of the navy had reached the limit. Shave speed, the moon step is empty, the hardness of iron, the penetration and power of the foot and the finger gun, and the flexibility of paper painting. The six naval styles have been greatly improved, even if it is not so difficult for him to deal with the devil Satan now. In the face of Lugosa's, he has been able to suppress him to the death. Come on Dieter. It's time to prove that you are the guild's first brother. I'm waiting for Lagosas to call you the boss. Ha 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 Lagosas, don't lose too badly. Even though Dieter is not as big as you, but his strength is far more than 90% of the members of the guild. 666, Fairy Tale's most exciting battle is about to begin. Let's see if Dieter is stronger or Lagosas is stronger. Dot. The guild members cheered on both sides. Most of the members are optimistic about Dieter, and the reason is naturally that Dieter has a better relationship with them than the arrogant Lagosas. Erda, Grey, Natsu, Kana, and the Mira Jane siblings all stared intently. Although I didn't call him Big Brother, everyone actually regarded Dieter as the Big Brother. Naturally hope he wins too. Don't say I don't give you a chance, let you make moves first. The opposite Lagosas were still proud, but Dieter didn't try to be hypocritical. He rushed over and punched Lagos's ill-fated face. Chi, Lagos has bared his nose in disdain, and used Taijutsu to fight Data in a bloody battle. Bang 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 tilde. There is no extra skill. The two of them didn't want to go to avoid each other's fists. You punch and I use the most basic physical strength to compete. The two people's feet were also slammed with cracks by the force. A little bit of gravel rolled out of the crack and rolled around, and the surroundings of the two were also cleaned up by the fist wind and aftermath. Finger gun. Data punched Lagosus again then stretched his index finger at him and used the pistol. Dang dang, Lagos's did not evade, and the arrogant face after resisting the finger gun changed somewhat. Obviously, he didn't expect the power of the finger gun to be much stronger than he imagined. Ha ha, it doesn't feel good to be handsome and tough. Finger gun madara. Dieter could of course see Lagos's expression, and the expression on his face after the hard resistance was not good, and he couldn't stand the power after thinking about it. He quickly increased his strength again and shot countless finger guns from between his fingers, locking Lagosas's body. Chi, do you think I'll let you hit me again? Zizi, Lagosas was disdainful. The earphones on his head burst out with yellow lightning arcs, and his body began to flicker at that moment, constantly dodging Dieter's moves. Interesting, Dieter narrowed his eyes. At this moment, Lagosas's body seemed to be elementalized, turning into a slender arc of lightning, and it was not so easy to attack him. Then let's have a speed contest. Six styles razor. The speed of the moon step and the fusion technique of shaving has been improved even more, and the figure has almost disappeared in front of him. Chase after the flickering Lagosas, Zizi, crackling. The two figures at the scene have completely disappeared. All the guild members could see was the shock wave generated by the collision in front of them and the potholes that often appeared on the ground. Only President Macruff can see clearly. Even Erza and Mira Jane, two talented and powerful people couldn't see the figure on the battlefield. This is a fight between gods and gods, I can't even see a human figure. Macau complained. Wakaba was already squatting on the ground and smoking sadly. Macau, 
if you want to open up, both Dieter and Lagosas are little monsters, it's normal that they can't see clearly, Natsu over there has gold stars in his eyes, it's amazing, I want to fight too, Grey shook his head and persuaded, forget it, Natsu, you're going to give it away, whether it's Lagosas or Dieter, they can easily defeat you, Grey, let's have a fight, to shut up, R? Exhibitionist wants to fight, come on, fire spitting guy, dot. Chapter 21 defeat Lagosas, exclamation mark thanks to Godog98 for the monthly pass, when Dieter and Lagosas appeared. The latter's breathing was no longer steady, he stared at Dieter who was looking at him solemnly, you guy, Lagosas was shocked, he always thought that no one in the guild would be his opponent, not even Dieter, who was known as a genius, but the result was far beyond his expectations, this Dieter was able to keep up with his speed, and the so-called finger gun was much stronger than expected, he was hit in several places on his body, although he was not punctured, he was still in pain. This is the first time he has been beaten to such a degree by his peers. Lagosas, you are weaker than I thought. Dieter's expression was light, and the bang just now was nothing but physical activity for him. He he I hope you will laugh again in the while. Zizzy Tilda. Lagosas sneered, Razor jumped on his earphones and on his hair, and a large number of thunder and lightning clouds were formed above Dieter's head. In the thunder cloud, the Razor swallowed clouds, and thunder and lightning were brewing. Thunder pressure and angry waves. Zizzy. Boom! Exclamation mark. The thunder cloud fell straight down, and the thunder dragon with thick wrists roared and crushed the opponent, about to tear the enemy to pieces. Paper painting. Dieter certainly wouldn't be hit, his body was as easy as a drawing on paper to control and dodge, and that flexibility also made the thunder dragon above his head fail. Boom. The thunder dragon failed to hit the enemy, and hit the ground as if angry, blasting open a pothole the size of a wash basin, and gravel fell everywhere. Thunder pressures angry waves. Thunder pressures angry waves. Thunder pressures angry waves. Lagosas continued to control the lightning to bombard Dieter. Dill's feet were blasted with big pits. He clearly never looked up at the angle of the thunder and lightning, but he still easily avoided all attacks. Furious Volt. Lagosas took the opportunity to release the move again, and a powerful high voltage radio wave spread around him. When the radio wave touched Dieter's body, he was instantly paralyzed by the radio wave, and his body froze. Good chance. Lagosas sneered and lightning bolted up in an instant, coming to Dieter in an instant, the jaw of Thunder Dragon. He clenched his fists and held them high in the air, the Thunder Dragon formed by lightning gathered in his fists and fell from the air like a roar, boom. The terrifying force hit the ground, the smoke lingered, and the dust stirred up, shrouding the surroundings in dust. Ha 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 I said you are not an opponent, but you still don't believe it, Lagosas laughed. This made the people watching the game a little worried, could it be that Dieter lost? The dust slowly dissipated, in the eyes of everyone. There were spiderweb-like cracks extending under Lagosa's feet, and the big pit in the center was several meters in diameter. The only thing that reassured everyone was the absence of Dieter. That's it? The sound came from the air, everyone looked up, Dieter stood in the air, and the airwaves under his feet maintained the floating figure. Damn it, you bastard. Lagosa's was furious, and the ferocious face made the thunder arc on his body even more violent. Lightning jumps in the mouth, his chest swelled like air, aiming at Dieter in the air. Thunder dragons. Roar. Since then. Lagosas has used Thunder Dragon Slayer magic, the power was palpitating, six styles razor, Dieter in the air did not dare to be careless, and immediately used the fastest speed to flash away, gang foot, after landing, the body rotated, and the vacuum slashes shot out, but it's not over yet, Dieter didn't wait for Lagosas to make any movement, and pointed his hands at him, flying spear finger three pulls, Bubba three consecutive air bombs were hit with the foot, ah, Lagosas had just finished releasing his move, and he could only resist the attacking move. When those attacks hit him, he couldn't help groaning. These attacks were much more powerful than the previous ones, making Lagosas even more angry. Resisting the pain in his body, he rushed to the ground. The stone bricks under his feet were shattered by the force, and the speed was close to the limit. I must beat you, Thunder Dragon's collapsing fist. The power of hatred. The electricity of the right fist Thunder Dragon covered the fist, desperately blasting this strongest power. It's over. Dieter's eyes didn't waver his fists clenched with strength brewing, watching the fist that carried the lightning strike, the muscles of the body tightened, iron block, after using the iron block, the body's defense is enhanced, and it is as hard as steel, boom, exclamation mark, the chest and fist collided, and the lightning burst, the dazzling gaze covered the two, and the onlookers covered their eyes, six types of profound truth, largest wheel, six king's spear, a voice was faintly heard, the dazzling thunder and lightning can't make people see the battle situation clearly, it's so dazzling, one. I seem to hear Dieter's voice just now. It should be Lagosa's. The power of the move just now can't be underestimated. No matter how strong Dieter is, I'm afraid he can't stop it. Dieter was too calm, and he dealt with it very well from start to finish. I'm afraid Lagosa's will lose. Dot.
The dazzling light lasted for a long time. When they opened their eyes again, they knew the final winner. Lagosas is defeated. Gray sighed, looking at the postures of the two sides in front of him, and already knew the end. Urza also shook his head. Lagosas is strong, but he is still weaker than Dieter. He was blocked by Dieter in the last move, and he took the opportunity to fight back. He may have been injured. Dieter took a step back, stretched out his hand to clean the shattered clothes, rubbed his chest and let out a heavy breath. Turn around and walk towards the guild. On the other hand, Lagosas kept the action for three seconds, and suddenly fell to the ground with both legs losing strength. Vomit. His eyes were bloodshot and he spit out blood, and his whole body shrank a lot. Before opening his mouth to speak, he fainted on the ground. Chapter 22 S-Class Mage, Dieter, ask for flowers, ask for an evaluation ticket. Three days later, the guild was lively again, and the injured Lagosas sat in the corner in confusion, out of tune with this prosperity. Another very calm is Dieter. Hey, Dieter. You're going to be announced as an S-Class mage in a while, aren't you excited? Macau came to Dieter's side with a drink, and patted his back with open palms. Bang bang bang, Dieter grinned. I'm not excited. I heard that there are a lot of big fish at the pier at Magnolia in the past two days. I just want to go fishing quickly, Dieter complained. Kana, opposite Macau, was also drunk and dizzy. He hiccuped, I don't know happiness in there. Dieter rested his chin in a bored distraction. Other guild members also came to congratulate. I didn't expect Dieter to become an S-rank mage a few years after joining the guild. How amazing. I heard that the president had discussed with you when he met you. I didn't expect you to have such brilliant achievements. Yeah, now Dieter, you've really become the boss of your peers in our guild. From now on, all your peers will call you big brother. Ha ha ha. Dot. The fairy tale guild has another S-rank magician, which is very happy for the members of the entire guild, and they are all proud of Dieter. Over there Erza and Mira Jane also stepped forward. I won't admit defeat, I've made a reservation for next year's S-Class Mages. Mira Jane, dressed as a bad girl, made an oath as she stepped on the table. Erz reached out and pulled Mira Jane off the table. Don't step on the table, and next year's S-Rank Mages belong to me. R. Natsu trotted over and warmly invited. Dieter, let's fight. Ask for contempt. R. You exhibitionist want to fight. Damn it's fire-breathing brat. Dot. Silent. The guild was as lively as ever. Just as Gray and Natsu were about to fight, President Makarov showed up and berated him. All the guild members kept their mouths shut. This year's S-rank mage assessment has ended. Makarov swept over all the members of the guild with a small sweep on his back. His eyes finally fell on Dieter, and announced with a smile, and the person who became an S-rank mage this year is, Dieter. Clap clap clap. The applause sounded, and the members of the guild applauded enthusiastically. Kudos to Dieter. Then let Dieter say a few words. Makarov invited. Surrounded by a group of people, Dieter scratched his head and walked to the guild leader. Time flies so fast, I have become an S-rank mage in the blink of an eye, and the days ahead are still very long. I hope everyone can make persistent efforts to maintain the reputation of our number one guild, Dieter said. I also I hope you can abide by the fairy tale guild rules, and we will work together in the future. Okay, or well, isn't listening to your words is really a speech. Ha ha, Dieter didn't do his homework. Everyone in the guild laughed and the rare opportunity to laugh would naturally not be missed. And Dieter couldn't help laughing when he saw such a lively guild atmosphere. Okay, Dieter will be an S-rank mage from now on. You can go to the second floor to make a commission. Let's go. Makarov dismissed the meeting with a smile. Dieter also stepped down amid the crowd's thanks. After a while, everyone in the guild was busy again, and those who did commissions also walked together. And Dieter walked up to Lagosas and sat down. Don't you agree? Zizi Tilda. Lagosas did not speak, but the arc on the earphone was beating indicating that of course he was not convinced. He he, come on, Dieter sneered, stood up and patted his shoulder, and whispered in his ear, keep your pride, you will never be able to raise your head in front of me one day with me in the guild! Exclamation mark. Ya yeah, Tilda. The lightning arc shattered the water glass on the table, and Lagosas disappeared in front of his eyes. Dieter grinned, Lagosas, it looks like you still need to be beaten by society. Humming a ditty Dieter walked to the commission bar. Yo Dieter wants to take a commissioned mission. Do I need to form a team? Nablaz Aro. A new member of the guild, was wandering in front of the commission column. I said Nab, all you're looking for is the quest you can do. Dieter quipped. Nab shook his head, his face full of regret. These tasks are too easy for me to do. Dieter just smiled at that. Swipe through the tasks posted on the commission bar, and finally choose the one that needs to be turned around in Magnolia. Go out of the fairy tale guild gate. Turning around to look at the guild, he whispered softly. Goodbye to fairy tale, and see you in a few years. Dot. Chapter 23 Devil Fruit Treasure Chest. Seeking flowers and evaluation tickets. Hard in town. Cities with developed fisheries also represent a rich variety of fish. If you can catch rare fish, it will be enough to sell for sky-high prices. Get the fish, 
hurry up and get the fish. If you can't catch any fish, you will go back to the guild and become an S-rank mage. On the sea, a boat is moored at a fishing spot. Dieter kept mumbling with his fishing rod, staring at the motionless float waiting for the fish to take the bait. Hey, it's been five years, and if you don't go back to the guild, the next time you come to see me will be the old guild leader, Dieter thought. Now twenty years old, he is already a big boy. It is estimated that he is the only one who has been away from home for five years and he is the only one who dares to fish for five years. Crackling Tilda, Diet to put away his fishing rod and stood up to stretch, his body rattling with activity after a long period of fishing. It's time to go back to the guild. Looking at the city not far away, Dieter picked up the oars and moved the sea to the shore. After landing, I randomly found a restaurant to get something to eat. You're such a nice guy, and you invited me to dinner with Happy. A.I. good man. As soon as he entered a certain restaurant, Dieter heard a familiar voice. Following the voice, I saw a blonde girl with big eyes that seemed to be able to speak. Ha 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 who am I talking about? It turned out to be Natsu and Happy Tilda. Dieter laughed and walked over there. He had met Natsu two years ago, and the two of them had dinner together when he passed by on a mission. Ha Dieter, long time no see. Dieter. Natsu stood up with a smile and greeted Dieter by hooking his shoulders. Happy also sits enthusiastically on his head, apparently happy too. Hello, I haven't seen you for two years, Natsu has grown a lot taller and happy is even cuter, Dieter smiled happily, it is also a pleasure to meet Natsu in Hajin, ha ha Dieter, let me introduce you, Natsu laughed, pull Dieter to sit down and introduce the girl opposite, she's called Louise, she's a good person, AI happy reconsideration, Lucy sighed and covered his forehead, murmuring a little, my name is Lucy, you idiot, but soon put on a smile and looked at Dieter, hello, Lucy, nice to meet you, Mr. Dieter greeted, the story is about to start in the blink of an eye, and it's no wonder Natsu is here, Louis, He's Dieter, our eldest brother, he's amazing. Natsu also patted Dieter's shoulder. My name is Lucy. Lucy corrected, smiling cutely at the same time, and said generously, Natsu saved me before, since you are his big brother, let's have dinner together, I'll treat you. Dieter, Louise is a good person. AI good man. Natsu and Happy laughed and continued to say the wrong name. Yeah, she's not only a cute girl, she's also a good girl, Dieter said, helping to correct, but Natsu, her name is Lucy. Not Lois, it's impolite to call a girl by the wrong name. Of, no, it's okay, Dieter. Big brother, you can order whatever you want. Lucy was embarrassed by what he said, and hurriedly asked. Dieter nodded, and only after ordering two random meals did he deliberately ask, Why did you come here, Natsu? I heard it's looking for Fire Dragon. Lucy interjected. Natsu nodded and said disappointedly, I heard that Igneal is in Harjan town, so I came here to see it. I didn't expect to find the wrong person. It's not easy to find someone in such a big town. Lucy said, but Dieter smiled and shook his head, Natsu is not looking for people, Natsu also nodded, Igneal is a dragon, a real dragon, what, Lucy opened his mouth in shock, but he still reacted quickly, and complained with a strange expression, since it is a dragon, how can it be in the city, shouldn't it be in the mountains or deep forests, ah, yes, AI, both Natsu and Happy leaked expressions of realization, ha Lucy couldn't complain, got up and put the meal money on the table, and thanked again, anyway, thank you for your help, I'll go first, you all eat slowly, Natsu and Happy immediately knelt down and said loudly, thanks for the hospitality, you're such a nice guy, AI, Lucy was immediately frightened by the sound, and waved his hand quickly, no, no, you make me embarrassed, Dieter smiled at them, ding, sign into the town of Harjan and reward 10 skill points, at this time, the words in his mind reappeared, instantly making the smile on Dieter's face even more ecstatic, five years, after a full five years, this ghost system was finally activated again, and the sign-in was successful, there is even a direct reward of 10 skill points, at 10 o'clock, that's a lot of money, Dieter couldn't wait to let out the ecstasy in the sky, fortunately, he still had to turn his face, took a deep breath to suppress the excitement in his heart, and immersed himself in his mind with excitement, looking at the devil fruit treasure chest that has been showing for 5 years, it is finally going to be open today, chapter 24, Superman, thanks to the monthly pass of 1,597,696, Dieter held back his excitement and chose to open the treasure chest, it takes 10 skill points to open the devil fruit treasure chest, do you want to open it, looking at the words that appeared in his mind, Dieter's excited heart felt as if he had fallen into the ice cave of eternity, and the cold made him feel extremely desolate, I thought I could save a lot of skill points by becoming rich, but I didn't expect that it would take 10 skill points to open a treasure chest, Take a deep breath, Dieter warned himself in his heart that the ghost system was not a human being, and he passed it with patience. After some self-soothing, Dieter felt much better. Watching the ten skill points disappear, my heart is still fierce, and I keep praying for a powerful devil fruit. The treasure chest opens, Dieter's eyes were full of white light, and his ears were buzzing and he almost went deaf. Fortunately, 
He recovered in a few seconds. Ding. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the superhuman type rubber fruit ability. The words came to mind. Reminds Dieter of the devil fruit abilities that Dieter has acquired. The bottom of the tree map is above the navy sixth form, which has been occupied by rubber fruits. You don't have to ask. You know that if you want to continue to the next stage, you will definitely need a lot of skill points to upgrade. The ability of the rubber fruit. Dieter exhaled a turbid breath, feeling the unusual body, and quickly grasped the initial changes of the rubber fruit. Strength, speed, and stamina have nearly doubled, as long as he is willing. He can instantly enter the second and third gears to attack, and at the same time, it can be merged with the navy sixth form to make the second gear faster. Woo! After Natsu and Happy thanked Lucy, they sat back in their seats and ate frantically, unable to speak clearly. Natsu said, Dieter, why don't you eat quickly? There's so much he can't finish. Happy acts as a translator. Dieter laughed and stopped thinking about the gains and losses of getting the rubber fruit ability. Then let's eat more than anyone else. As soon as Dieter finished speaking, his hands became slightly longer, and he rolled the food on the table into his mouth and swallowed it directly. Natsu and Happy across from them were dumbfounded. You dot 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 you don't you? Natsu stuttered. And Dieter stood up and walked outside with a smile. I don't need it. The advantage of rubber fruit is that no matter how much you eat, you can hold it. There is really no difference between chewing and chewing. The characteristics of the body will actively digest those foods. Wait for me. Natsu and Happy immediately followed. Dot. It was dark. The stars in the sky gleamed and bloomed in their afterglow, making everything under the night clearly visible. I'm so full. On Dakohashi, Dieter was blowing with Natsu and Happy here. Happy looked at the boats on the sea and said, By the way, the fire dragon said that he would have a party on the boat so that's the boat. Ouch I want to vomit. Natsu immediately covered his mouth when he heard the boat and looked ugly. Happy complained. Please don't get seasick just by imagining it, okay? Ha ha Dieter laughed, looking at Natsu's impolite taunt. Natsu, your shortcomings can't be corrected. In the future, leave all the battles on the ship to me. Oh I want to vomit. Natsu was so embarrassed that he didn't dare to look at the boat. Look. That's Lord Fire Dragon's ship. I seem to be participating too, Lord Fire Dragon. The three beauties shopping next to them looked at the boats on the sea and discussed enviously. Dieter looked at them. Don't you know? He's currently in the city, and I heard he's a wizard of the super famous fairy tale guild, said one of the women. Natsu, who was about to vomit, was stunned. Looking at the three ladies with serious eyes, he repeated in a bad tone, fairy tale. Looking back at the ships in the sea, he immediately covered his mouth again. I want to vomit. Happy silent Tilda. Dieter also remained silent. After waiting for Natsu to feel better, Dieter put on a frosty smile, raised his arm and pointed at the sailboat on the sea. Fairy tale, Natsu, it seems that our guild has also sullied some unscrupulous people. Yeah, Natsu nodded seriously, then, destroy him, destroy him. The two said in unison. After looking at each other and smiling, Happy grew wings from behind to grab Natsu, looked at Dieter and asked, Dieter, do you need me to fly with you? There was a surge of air under Dieter's feet, suspended in midair. No need. Swoosh Tilda. The figure flickered, sprinting towards the sailboat on the sea. Dot. On board. Your name is Lucy, isn't it? What a nice name. Paula filled a glass with juice in the cabin. Lucy forced a smile in her evening gown. Thank you. Let's have a drink first, Paula said with a cool expression. D.A. Tilda. After snapping his fingers, the juice in the glass floated, and Lucy was absent-minded and felt a strong sense of drowsiness. Come on, open your mouth, and the gem of the fruit will slowly slide into your mouth. Hearing Paula's words. Lucy got goosebumps and yelled in his heart, I'm sick of it. But soon, Lucy woke up suddenly, raising the palm of his hand to blow the juice away. He asked cautiously, What are you trying to do? You are using the sleep magic sleep, right? Paul a grinned, He he, you know quite a lot. Seeing Paula's shameless confession, Lucy said angrily, Don't get me wrong, I really want to join Fairy Tale, but I don't want to be your woman. Paula let out a sarcastic smile, You're really tough. At this time, the curtains of the cabin were pulled open and a group of men walked over with a wicked smile clutching the women. Lucy was surprised, what the hell is going on? Welcome to my ship. Paula opened her eyes and looked at Lucy. Better be nice to me before I get to Persian, little girl. Lucy panicked, looking at the group of comatose girls puzzled. What Persian brother, then? What about fairy tale? Paula laughed. Lucy's shoulders twitched, her head lowered and her teeth gritted. What the hell is going on with this guy, to actually do such a thing? Could it be that? Is this the magician of fairy tale? Peng. The cabin roof was cracked. Natsu fell into the cabin, startling everyone. Natsu. Lucy was overjoyed. And Natsu stood on the boat, handsome for only three seconds, and immediately curled up and covered his mouth. I want to vomit. Outside the hole, Dieter and Happy also leaked out. Ha ha Natsu, it's a bit embarrassing that you can't be handsome for three seconds. Dieter laughed. AI Happy is also sure. Happy, brother Dieter, Lucy snickered again, but could immediately react. Happy how can you fly? Aren't you a cat? And how can you fly, Brother Dieter? Chapter 25, 
my brother will take you to fly, thanks for the monthly ticket of learning road, long road, yo Lucy is there too, Dieter greeted with a smile, happy flew in, wrapped its tail around Lucy's waist, and flew out, the detailed process will be discussed later, let's go first, hey Lucy said hurriedly, looking at the sailing boat that was drifting away, wait, Natsu and Dieter, don't you mind them, happy leaked a weird expression, it's okay, there's Dieter here, on board, damn it, don't try to escape, look at my flame whip, Paula waved his hand, a fiery red magic circle appeared in front of him, and the flame whip shot from the magic circle towards Lucy and Happy in the air. Hey, it's really good when I don't exist. Dieter shook his head. He raised his arm and stretched out his index finger to watch the attacks. Finger gun. Madara. Bang 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 tilde. The arm turned into an afterimage and met those flame whips in the air. Clap clap clap. The flame whip was hit, and all Dieter exploded in front of him. Who the hell are you? Paula asked, looking at Dieter in the air, staring at him. He will continue to attack. Hey, uncomfortable. Natsu stood up on the hull, ready to attack. Chi. Paula raised her foot unhappily at Natsu and punched and kicked. Dieter in the air fell in from the outside, looking at Natsu who was beaten by the group and couldn't help laughing and crying. Natsu, why bother? Let me help you, said and looked at the group of people in front of him. You must be too arrogant here. Paula resented, and waved her order. Everyone, kill him. Dieter shook his head. Shave. Finger gun. Boob the Batilda. In less than three seconds. All the people in front of him were wounded and fell to the ground. You, Paula panicked. My group of younger brothers can't hold on to this person for three seconds. How is this possible? Is this guy really that strong? Damn it. Go to hell. Slam la. Paula was about to fight when she heard a raging wave. Looking out the window, the huge wave stirred up and rushed towards the sailboat. The huge wave seemed to be a ruthless devil trying to shoot everyone into the deep sea. Oops I don't have to play. Dieter smacked his lips, looked at Natsu, and said, Natsu, help my brother clean up this waste. I'll take it out first. Okay. Vomit. I want to vomit. Natsu still pulled across. Dieter didn't care too much, jumping out of the sailboat and watching the huge waves set off the boat and hit the dock. By the coast, there was a loud bang. The dock was destroyed by ships, and countless people fled with their lives. No one could watch the play under such circumstances. Natsu big brother Dieter. Below Happy and Lucy wave their hands towards this direction. Dieter fell from the air, grabbed Lucy's slender waist and stepped back a few meters. Don't disturb Natsu. These people let him deal with it, huh? But Natsu, Lucy worried, Happy grinned, Lucy, actually Natsu and Dieter are both sorcerers, what? Lucy was taken aback, the color contacts swept across Dieter's face, then looked at Natsu standing up in the smoke of the ship, surprised, on the boat, Natsu looked down at Paula and asked, you said you were the wizard of fairy tale, didn't you? There was only Paula left alone, and he retorted, so what? Natsu jumped off the boat, threw his jacket away, stared sharply at Paula, and scolded, let me take a good look at your face. He stepped forward and walked forward. I'm Natsu from the Fairy Tale Guild. I have never heard of your character. Startled, Lucy's eyes widened in surprise. With a stiff head, he turned his head to look at Big Brother Dieter next to him. His voice stuttered, Big, Big Brother, you dot 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 you. Happy sat on Dieter's shoulder, took out a fish from the backpack behind him and ate it. Yes, we are all wizards in the Fairy Tale Guild. Are? It turned out to be, Lucy was stunned. She didn't expect that the person she accidentally met was the sorcerer who had always longed for the guild, and she felt ashamed when she remembered what she said before, which would be a shame. Big Brother Dieter, are we going to help? Lucy hurriedly put aside the subject. Happy suddenly pulled a face. Looking at Lucy very seriously, he said, Lucy, don't let Dieter go, he won't be able to play, and the whole city will be destroyed. Huh? Big Brother Dieter dot 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 that's amazing. Lucy couldn't believe it, Natsu looked very good. Could it be that Big Brother Dieter is even more powerful? But it doesn't look like it. Happy continued, Dieter is an S-class wizard. What? Lucy's whole body seemed to be struck by thunder. Standing sluggishly by the side, the words Happy kept echoing in his brain. Big Brother Dieter dot 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 S-class mage. This, Dieter disagreed and shouted at Natsu who was fighting. Natsu, you are doing beautifully. You are too good. I want to be your little brother. You are too strong now. Natsu jumped to his feet when he heard Dieter's words. He glared at him with shame. You bastard. Are you kidding me on purpose? If it was in the past, he definitely didn't think there was any problem, but he knew clearly that Dieter's strength should not be underestimated. Dealing with this unworthy person will definitely kill in an instant. Natsu he. Lucy was puzzled. This is obviously a compliment to Natsu. Why does he look unhappy? Happy answered in a timely manner. It's called a slap kill. It says Natsu. Why are you so rude? The fight is too slow. Why don't I get in? In fact, Dieter only needs one second to kill this guy. Lucy's heart skipped a beat. One second? Is brother Dieter that strong? Obviously looks very pleasant and eclectic. Fire dragon apostrophe s dot 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 iron fist. Boom. Paula was sent flying with an iron fist. 
and the fight was over. Natsu, you've spent up to five minutes in total, do you know how many fish I can catch in those five minutes? Dieter said. Natsu scratched his hair awkwardly, he he he, whoa, whoa, whoa tilde. At this time Harjan's army came in line, the army is coming, run. Natsu shouted, Dieter raised an eyebrow, a princess picked up Lucy and flew away. R, big brother Dieter. Let me down Lucy was shy, Dieter looked down at the pretty face close at hand and said, aren't you going to join fairy tale, be obedient, my brother will take you to fly. Ah Lucy blushed and couldn't hide her excitement, yeah. Dot. If you like this audiobook, subscribe the channel for more videos like this. And join my Patreon if you want to support me, link in the description. Leave some comment and let me know if you guys like this story or you have a web novel you like and want to hear its audiobook, I will be happy to create them for you. Please like, share, and leave a comment on the video.